Howdy! <coughs> ah. Hi, everybody! Welcome! Tonight is the night! It is certainly the evening. Tonight is the day. It is the time. Is now. Hold on, sorry. Sorry, I forgot to type something. Hi, everybody! I want a mechanical keyboard. Where do I get them? I don't even know where to go for it. Online? No, 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 no. I want a nice one. I want an enthusiast one, not like Corsair or Steel Series or any of that bullshit. I want something pristine that I deserve as a big handsome boy. I deserve a big handsome keyboard. No, you don't. Why not? Why don't I want one? Huh? Advantage 2? That's what Vince has, I think. Oh, I had an idea for merch. <laughs> we might have some stuff coming out soon. I had a couple ideas. I know that's that's apropos of nothing. That came out of nowhere, but... Stuff might be here soon. Coney, random question. Have you ever tried to open back headphones? I don't even know what those are. Open back headphones? Open back? Huh? They're for audio files. Oh, I don't even notice or care. What are these? Ten best open back headphones and why you need them. Open back owns offers a more immersive sound experience, brief breathability. Feel like you're in the room with a singer podcaster. What do you mean open back? What does that mean? What does open back mean? What? Is this new? Is this like a new thing? I've never heard of open back. 2022, 2016. Okay, so it's not new. I don't know what that means. Look, I wear these because HyperX pays me to wear these. And because they're comfy. Thank you, Joe Star. Thank you, Drago Lonk. Coney, did you get a tan? No. Not at all. <clears throat> I'm not a big audio guy because my ears suck anyway. I can't hear anything. I can't hear nothing at all. Welcome, everybody. We got three things on the docket. We got to record for next week on YouTube. The Genie video did good. I'm so proud of you guys. Guys, seriously. That Genie video, I've wanted to do that for a long time and it actually worked. It did well, and I'm I'm genuinely happy when stuff like that does well. 
Because I think it's fun. It's so stupid, but I think it's fun and funny. So thank you guys for checking out the YouTube. Um, Friday is another video. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> You'll see. When's Def Jam? I don't know. I was going to play Def Jam tomorrow, but then I remembered that I have a HelloFresh stream. So... Don't think I can do that. Tomorrow is the second HelloFresh one. I don't think that'll work. Thank you, Silver. Are you doing another food game? I don't know, actually. I haven't, I've, I've been trying to think about it. I don't know what the answer is. Honestly, I've kind of wanted to play Tropical Freeze again, as weird as that is. And I might just go buy a copy of GameStop and be like, this game has bananas. Bananas is food. You know? Cooking stream? I just don't like cooking streams. I don't like doing it. Because, like, I gotta, I gotta get it all set up. And I thought it would be funny to do that with the, um, with, like, a chef hat and stuff. But it's too much setup. Thank you, Top Tier Harley. I like the pink panda hat. Is that for sale? Uh, I don't know, actually. Go to panda.gg slash shop, and you'll see. Might be there. This is for, for the uh, BCRF line, Breast Cancer Research Foundation. I think we're out. I think it was very short. Uh, Kony, you're going to play slash try Pokemon Arceus on Sunday. Um. I've thought about it. I keep going back and forth. You know what the problem is? Everybody says that it... I'm seeing reviews that say it's like 8 out of 10. You know, it, it's 8.5. Like, it's good. But I feel like I see that for every Pokemon game. Every time one comes out. You know what I mean? It'll get viewers, but the game will be mid at best. It, will it? I don't know if I'll get viewers. I'm not in the Pokemon camp at all. Going back to earlier about the Genie video I watched this morning. I'm a big fan. Keep it up. Thank you. I, I like that stuff. I think it's fun and funny. I've been hearing it's actually fun. Hey, if it's fun, I like that better. Ever considered streaming old FPS games like Doom, Blood, Quake? No. <laughs> no. I don't care about those games at all. Not even a little. I barely played old regular games, let alone FPS, like, niche, you know? Going back to the keyboard talk, here you go. Hold on. I trust you, Will. Don't let me down. Hold on. Oh, dude, I love this! Oh, my God! I love this. Oh, my God. I genuinely love this. Dude, engage. <laughs> I feel like a, a bear. <laughs> These are like paw. Oh, dude, I actually like this. I actually really like this. Unironically, I like this. I, I don't care. I like the Moonlander. Hmm. I have seen this. Hold on. I looked this up because I went on uh, the Battle Station subreddit today to see, uh, to, to just get some inspiration for new keyboards and stuff. I found something called the Lumberjack Keyboard. Look at this. It's a keyboard with a, a fucking split in the middle. That's it. it. There's just a hole in the middle. Look. <laughs> That's crazy. I actually really like it. I actually like it a lot. Why? I don't know, but I like it. Don't go into the custom keyboard rabbit hole. I want to, though. I deserve something that is uniquely me. Okay? I want something fancy. Just for me. Just for Kony. The, the Lumberjack is only 20 bucks for the PCB. It's just out of stock or whatever. Dude, I like this. 
I actually unironically like this. The Kony keyboard really fucking loud. Blue switches. Absolutely blue switches. For sure. So I wanted to show you guys something before we get started. I love this so much. I am so glad that this happened. <laughs> so Scrub Quotes tweeted something today. Actually, should I even... Hold on. Okay. I'll, I'll give you the whole context. I'll walk backwards. This is in reverse order of how I discovered the information. Ooh, thank you, Hamel Sauce. Thank you so much for the gift. I appreciate it. 2111. Good year. Okay, I'm gonna go backwards from when I discovered this. If running the killer for five gens doesn't get you the win, was it really a skilled play in the first place? Says Patrick. Dead by Daylight lead game developer or designer, whatever. Thank you, Bandito Del Tacos. Uh, so I guess what he's trying to say here is if you can, it, he's mocking this guy. The developer is saying if you have the killer targeting you while your teammates do five generators, which is the objective of the game, but it doesn't win you the game, is it really a good play, right? Thank you, Toyo. Oh my god, Toyota Toyota. I hate that. I don't like that name. I get what he's trying to say. And he made this tweet, and he got like 4K likes. I get why you would make fun of the designer for this. I, Like, the whole point is that, yes, you are distracting the one killing guy, the one bad guy, for five generators. So, yeah, that's pretty skillful, right? That's the whole point of the game. Whatever. He said that, and this tweet went around. 4K likes almost. I logged on today to find my Twitch shirts in Dead by Daylight have been removed from my account. I guess the devs have time to remove a cosmetic from my account, but not enough time to take feedback from the community and address one of the biggest issues in their game. And I was like, wait. So wait, did they remove cosmetic items from this guy just to... Yes, actually, they did. Hello, Josh. The team was made aware of some recent conduct that does not meet the standards of exemplary conduct that content creators who own these items are expected to uphold. In this case, targeting a member of the development team. As such, these items have been removed and will not be returned. <laughs> Don't make fun of us. That hurts our feelings. Very mean. How rude. Dude, that is amazing, though. Imagine if that happened in Smash. You make fun of Sakurai, and you wake up the next day, and your cuphead me is gone. It's only 75 cents, but Sakurai wants you to put that back in. No more Cuphead. No more Fallout Boy. Is that what his name is? The Fallout guy. <laughs> Fallout Boy's the band. No more any of that. Just remove them. This decision is final. The team can remove cosmetics from a player, but don't have time to Dude. uncap the frame rate from 60 Omega Lal. Dead by Daylight is trash. It's just a not it's just a bad game. I don't know how you fix it. I know some people are really gonna like it, obviously. I know some people are till they said some shit and Falco is gone. I know some people it really resonates with. But it's just tag, bro. It's just tag. It's a good game, but just bad devs. No, it's not. Dead by Daylight would genuinely work better if it had the same knockout city uh Ninjala Splatoon art style. Seriously. It's that kind of game. It's just dressed up like it's adult. It's so simple. You guys don't understand what I'm saying? It's a very simple game, but it's dressed up like it's adult and like you're, you're actually killing people. You're not. You're playing tag. Just make it a tag game. Make the game on a schoolyard. Oh, I think my wife just got home. I'm going to say goodnight to my baby. I'll be right back. Uh, you guys keep reading this. One sec.
Okay. Hi, everybody. Sorry about that. I had to go say goodnight to the baby. She just got home. Thank you, Fomium. Thank you, Real KXR. Thank you guys for the subs. Da, da. No, I'm not going to bed. The baby's going to bed. Stop. <laughs> Relax. She's sleepy. Kony, do you realize you end up liking everything you riff on? Speedrunning, VTubers, DVD. I don't riff on VTubers. I just think it's weird. I still hold that stance. Not to say it's not good, right? I'm not saying it's not a good thing. It's just a weird thing. Uh, speedrunning is a weird thing when you get down to it. Fortnite? I never riffed on Fortnite. You're getting... What do you think I am? You just think I'm the average Twitch streamer? I have my own opinions. I think Fortnite is amazing. I unironically like Fortnite. I'm not a contrarian. If I was a contrarian, why would I... I... Okay. Ooh, baby. <laughs> Sorry, just talked to my boy Mikey. My boy Mikey! Okay. No, Dead by Daylight sucks. It's not good. People saying you like Corona because VTuber, but you only really just like funny broken English. Kind of, yeah. I like it when they say something funny. Because it's it's like... It's not even the broken English. It is hearing the other... It's it's like hearing another perspective on how I would say something. Last Action... Dude, I saw that movie literally two nights ago. Last Action Hero. Oh my god. Dude, that movie rules. Have you guys ever seen that movie? I'm not kidding. It's good. I love Arnold Schwarzenegger. I love him so much. 90s Arnold is amazing. It's so bad. All of his movies are awful. I had the Mega Drive game of it. It sucked. Yeah, the games are not good. I feel like... I feel like culture has gone backwards since then. I really feel like when I watch those movies, there's nothing like that now. I feel like now, if a movie wants to be tongue-in-cheek and, and, and silly and, like, satirical, it's like Deadpool. And it's too... I don't know what I watched Last Action Hero, why I'm okay with it. Because it's, it's, it's doing the same thing, right? But it's all IPs now? Maybe. I don't know. Too on the nose? Yeah, but Last Action Hero is pretty on the nose. The kid sucks, too. That's the worst kid actor I have ever seen. Satire now needs to tell you it's satire. I feel like everything is just references. We've reached a point where, like, the internet loves to obsess over, like, hey, is this thing connected to that thing? Is this, is this piece of media connected to that one? He's doing the pose that this character does in this, it's just, it's too much. This multiverse shit has gone too far. Thank you, Killian. Last action here, Jingle All The Way. Oh, do Jingle All The Way. Absolutely. Jingle, Jingle All The Way is amazing. Deadpool looks at the camera and says, this thing is bad. Last Action Hero makes a bad movie cheekily. Last Action Hero has, like, renowned, world-famous actors in it. And not just, like, you know, actors, but, like, Charles Dance, um, Ian McKellen, Anthony Quinn, I think is his name. I can't remember what his last name is. But, like, these are Shakespearean true actors. Legitimate thespians. I was watching the movie, and I'm like, is that the fucking guy from from Game of Thrones? It was. It's Charles Dance, who's Tywin Lannister. Blew my mind. Insane. Coinbase is reaching out to streamers for create, create an NFT bounties. Wait, really? 
<laughs> Wait, what? Coinbase is doing that? Why haven't I gotten the call, bro? Dude, did you guys see the Jimmy Fallon NFT clip? Oh my god, hold on. Dude. It's crazy. Okay. This is insane. This is on national television. <laughs> I know, I heard. I'm I so happy I taught you what they were. You did. You taught me what's <laughs> up, and then I bought an ape. I got an ape, too, because I saw you on the show with people, and you said you got a moon pay, so I went and I copied you and did the same thing. You did? Mm-hmm. This is your, this is your ape. Yeah, we debuted. it's really cool. <laughs> The hat, the shades. And what? The lady said, aww. Aww. And what? That's her ape. <laughs> There's a smash joke in here somewhere. Where you just replace this with Diddy and Jimmy's with, or this with Donkey and Di uh, Jimmy's with Diddy. You could make a meme out of this. You and could what? definitely make a meme out of this. How do you pick? Because you can pick your, your, your ape. Yes, I was going through a lot of them, and I was like, I want something that like kind of reminds me of me, but I, I, this one, it's it does. I think we, we made like another version of it where he takes the hat off and blonde hair comes out. Uh -huh. so. yeah, Dude, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make that funky. Hers is funky, because funky wears a hat. It'll be funny. You do now whatever you want. It'll be good. Mm -hmm. Animated version. We're part of the same. We're part of the same oh, community. We're yes. both apes. I love it. Uh, here's my. Ape. This is my ape. Yours. <laughs> Yours is so cool. I love the red heart sunglasses. I love the captain hat. It reminded me of me a little bit because I wear striped shirts. <laughs> I've worn these heart sunglasses because my daughters, just as a joke, they have them, and I, as a joke, I put them on. So I've done this, and I love yacht rock and being breezy. So I'm like, yeah, that kind of, and I like the blue. Mm-hmm. Dude, look at us. They look like they could be friends. They're buddies. <laughs> Dude, the crowd loves it. The crowd loves this, bro. Oh, man. How did they get this on television? I got an ape, too, because I saw you on the show with people, Jimmy, and you said you got a moon chase, up. so I hold went up to the and camera. I copied you and did the same thing. You did? Mm -hmm. Hold it up. This is your... This That's is your mine. Ape. Come on, everyone clap. Yeah. Really everyone cool. clap. Come on, come on, come on. Like everyone the clap. The shades. And what? That's pretty good. Dude, what kills me? Your ape. Um, I think... He... Look at Jimmy's face here. Jimmy's face is so fucking funny. He's just, it's just, there's no, it's, <laughs> there's no expression of joy. I think he realizes how this is going to go over online. I really think so. Like, I, uh, listen, I don't know enough about, uh. Imagine telling Johnny Carson that talk shows would I, be like this in 50 years or so. Hey, listen, Johnny Carson would have shilled the fuck out of NFTs. I think, I don't know. I assume. Listen, if you're on a talk show and you're a host, that's what you do. You show whatever they put in front of you. And then you either walk and you put away years and years of, of your life and career or you say, you know, all right, I'll show your thing. I don't know enough about NFTs. Like, I've read all the arguments and, like, I, I just, I don't even know. Like, I, I hear it's bad for the environment because of the crypto mining, blah, blah, blah. I don't, I'm not taking a stance one way or the other. I don't really give a shit. Um... It does seem silly to me, but I a lot of things seem silly to you and I don't know them, but uh regardless <laughs> clearly Jimmy here is uncomfortable. So Coney, would you like to see a two hour video on why it's bad? I actually have it up in my browser over here. Not a joke. I have it up on my other screen, I just haven't watched it yet. Man. I just couldn't believe what I was watching. Crazy. Okay. 
I'm gonna skip the rest of this. I don't like this Mario noise. Reminder that TV doesn't have disclosed promotional or sponsored content. They can blend it in seamlessly. Really? Content creators have to disclose it by law. Tom Scott did the Wow. Wait, TV doesn't have to disclose it at all? That's crazy. Huh. Thank you, Geeky Pickles. Thanks for the prime. That, huh. You would think they would have so much more regulation. They're on fucking television, bro. What? Did we finish the scrub quotes thing? Oh, I didn't have anything else to say. It just was very funny to me that they, uh, <laughs> that they took away this guy's skins. That's it. They took away his shit. That's all I, that is the last, and then I said LMAO. If you see me type in all caps LMAO, that means I laughed at something. Out loud. Which is what I did. I think that's pretty funny. I was actually reading something about Dead by Daylight. They they have an issue with a certain skin in the game. Uh, that is kind of fucked up. It showed up in my YouTube recommended. It was kind of interesting. Uh, there's a... I, I don't know if this is the conversation to have here. Because it's kind of a deep discussion. But there's an issue in the game. The blackface shit. Yeah. So, one of the characters in Dead by Daylight is black. Uh, her name is Claudette, I think. And, uh... The guy from Texas Chainsaw Massacre... Uh, he has skins in the game where you can wear other people's faces. And one of them is hers. And now there's this big thing where people are wearing her face specifically to target people. And some people have taken the stance that, like, well, he's Texas Chainsaw. He doesn't care what color you are. He's going to kill you and eat you. And people on Twitch, like, black creators on Twitch are like, okay, but they're doing this to me specifically. So it's like, it's it's kind of messy. I, yeah. If the internet gets weird about it, just take it out. Who cares? Yeah, I think they just removed it, which is the right call. I understand why people are like, you know... He doesn't care. It's part of the game. It feels more infantilizing to take it out. But at the same time, if it's actually creating problems for people, you have to do something, right? You have to. People that play Dead by Daylight are weirdos. That's my bottom line, bro. Play a better game. Truly. Okay. It seems like one of those things where the instinct is to be like, who cares? It's just the game. But like... You have to think about it a little bit more, and taking that first step is sometimes harder for people to do than they think. And I don't mean this in a demeaning way, like, why don't you guys do X? It's just like, some people just sort of rely on that base instinct of like, my gut says this is not the right thing to do. It's like, yeah, but you gotta listen to people, you know? Friday the 13th was so much better. Bro, they're putting out uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre next. It's the same team. I'm so excited. It's kind of funny that people want to cancel the serial killer for being racist. He's not even. That's the crazy thing. He does it to everybody. <laughs> How unfortunate, though. That's been in the game forever. All right, let's, uh... He's like your dad that's like, I hate everybody equally. <laughs> All right, uh... Let's get started. Like, at that point, it's not about what it means canonically. It's about negatively affecting real people. Yeah, but that's the problem. If you're coming in and you don't know anything about it, you just hear the outrage. You, like, if you're not in the community, you hear it and you're like, this is dumb. Why are your people making a fuss? But, like, you got to do a little bit more, you know? See it beneath the surface, so. Carson wouldn't have shilled YouTube his bit with Uri Geller. Oh, really? Was he a man of principle? Okay. I don't know, bro. I feel like I feel like we're at a point where shill or die. It's 2022. You shill or you die. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Let's get started. It's shill and die? Not if you're shilling well enough. <laughs> if you get good enough at shilling, you'll live. 
I'm going to heaven. Going to the rapture. All right. Uh, so what we're going to do tonight, we're going to do three things. Uh, web surf in the middle, I think. So let's get started. Damn, dude. Picture perfect 1,000 views. Amazing. Hello, everybody. Oh, this is a good song. Shame about the game. Is it here? All right. Now, usually I stay on just chatting, but there's a big Smash uh, tournament happening tonight. So we're going to try to soak up some of those because it's Smash night. <laughs> Not really, but we're going to pretend like it is. Okay. Tweets out. Boost it, please. Hit the boost on me. I appreciate it. Okay. We're doing this one again. I love this series, by the way. I found enough movesets. I love this series. Okay. Do I have the, uh, do I have the videos up? Oh, I didn't save them. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. We're doing Nerd versus Sakurai again. <laughs> Perfect. I love this series. I really do. I wish there was more. I was trying to find stuff for it. This is a series that's a fun idea, but you got to find the right shit for it, you know? Like, it's hard to... It's actually not... I, I, there aren't that many videos as you would think. So, all right, we're doing it again. Here we go. This is a funny song for this. I DM'd you a bunch more. Yeah, I saw them, but they were not... They. I don't want to do Ganon, because Ganon clearly needs a new moveset, right? Or like Dark Samus. There's no comparison. Because they're just clones. We need new shit. And you're going to see new shit tonight. All right, here we go. <laughs> Fellas, we're doing it again. We saw it before. And we... I shouldn't even do an intro like this. Because people are going to not see the first one. We'll do a new one. We'll do a new one. <laughs> Fellas, Smash Ultimate is over. Super Smash Brothers is never coming back. Sakurai said he doesn't think there will ever be another Smash game. I think that's copium. Have you seen how much money these games make? Eventually, it's going to come back. But with Ultimate Ending, all these characters are locked in and they'll never be changed. What if we never see a real Ganondorf? What if we never see Dark Samus with anything different? There are so many characters in the game that could have been done better. But how much better? We're back with the series Sakurai vs. the Nerd. Now, if you weren't here for the first one, essentially what we do is we're taking a look at movesets that are in Smash, and we're comparing the moveset as it is in the game now. Sakurai's vision of the character, what he put into Ultimate, against this dork's idea of what a character should be. Now, usually these are fan-made movesets. Uh, these are things that came up before the characters came out. It's actually kind of cool. Because you could go back and see years and years and years of people wanting a lot of these characters in the game. Ultimate brought everybody in. And tonight, we're going to take a look at some fan favorites who finally found their way into Ultimate and say, Hey, who had the better moveset? Sakurai or the nerd? Let's take a look. Thank you, all-powerful Tuna. Now, tonight has a bit of a theme. I'll let you see if you can uh, decipher what it is, but... Maybe I'm a little selfish, but the first one that we're going to do is my guy. <laughs> it's my guy. I'm so sad. I'm so sad with how they handle Banjo. Truly. It is depressing. He is the most boring character in the game. It's tragic. Now, this video in particular, I need you to know, was for Project M. So they were adding Banjo into Project M. This, the date is, I believe, after he came out. But this mod has been in the works for a long time. It was coming out long before he came out. So, apparently it's very different. What we're going to do is watch this and say, okay, did they have the right idea or did Sakurai have the right idea? And I have a feeling this is going to be a free point for the nerd. Because uh, <laughs> Sakurai didn't even try, bro. He doesn't even care. So sad. 
I think the nerd wins this round for free. Hey everyone, most of you have probably seen a lot of teases and hints that a banjo mod is coming to Project M. I'm here Bro 2019, Jesus. I'm here to let you know that those rumors are true, and David and I have been co-leading this project since last April. That's However, so long. However, in June, when Banjo was announced officially, it was very difficult to stay motivated. So I decided <laughs> to create this video to let you see what he looks like so far. Bro, that's so sad. They were making him and Sakurai put him out and they're just like, okay, never mind. I hope you enjoy. Sakurai, you got it. Man. Well, let's see if they were on the right track. Who knows? Not a great animation, but that's okay. Can't be perfect. Already a point for Sakurai. Yeah, that's a W. You see a Project M move set and a character, you're just like, I'm gonna make that. What if it was one to one? What if he just copied this? <laughs> Wait, is this? This is Smash 4. Or is it Ultimate? Is he an Ultimate? I can't tell what game this is. That's ultimate. Is it... What? Brawl? No, but this is... That's Smash 4. It... I'm so confused. Sm Project M uses ultimate texture. Smash 4 Battlefield. But it's... It's PM. But Donkey Kong looks new. But he looks shitty. I'm so confused. It's a stage mod? How do you explain this? This is a Smash 4 stage. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. Bro, Lu Waluigi is in the- What is he doing here? I'm so confused. Okay, whatever. Back to the target. Back to the target at hand. One of the first Who's goals better? for this project was for it to feel like a seamless transition from his game to Super Smash Bros. For starters, we did his double jump. Oh, that's awful. Wait. Bro, that double jump sucks. From his game to he Super goes Smash nowhere. Bros. For starters, we did his double jump. Oh, but it does look like it is like the real game. That is like the real game. It's bad, though. I don't know if I would like playing this. Bro, you gotta jump just to recover. Like, if you get knocked off stage over here, you gotta you gotta jump immediately and slowly fly in. Ugh. The next move was his jab. I wanted to make sure that he kind of walked forward a little bit, just like he did in the game. That's better. That's way better than what's in the real game. This one's yeah. pretty given. Ultimate also used this one as well. Sure. Obvious. Obvious. No points given. Ultimate also used this one. Alt jab is better? No. What are you talking about? No, no, no. The beak thing? The trrr, no, I don't like that. Kind of interesting to see what the similarities are. Wait, what is this? Ultimate down tilt? also used this one. Yeah. It's kind of interesting to see what the similarities are. Yeah, same thing. Sure. Yeah. Thank you, Batracuda. For the forward tilt, we took that from Banjo Tui. Instead of three hits, <laughs> it's just one. Well, that's kind of the same thing as what he has. Oh my god, look at Kazooie's head. Jesus. It's pretty much the same thing, right? It just, it's worse. But if you could angle it, it would be the same. Instead of three hits, it's just one. The next one is an <laughs> original. We kind of wanted it to just feel happy. That's Mario. You just that okay? Point for Sakurai on this. This is a point for Sakurai on this. We kind of uh, wanted it to just feel. Happy. <laughs> what is that kick? Look at that little kick he does. The next is the pack whack from Banjo Tooie. It hits on all sides, so we thought it would be perfect for a down smash. That's better. That's actually pretty good. The I like that. The next one is the Briegel Buster. Ultimate wanted to use this for their forward smash as well. Yeah. Mine really needs some animation improvements, and so that's something <laughs> that is still... Because <laughs> he's just... There's no reaction. 
This is hard to animate, though, right? I guess, like, facial expressions are the last thing you're going to do. Hold on, I'm in the way. Look at this poor Kazooie. Look at this poor young lady. <laughs> it's just, just laying on the ground, whatever. Who cares? Life is meaningless. The flip flap is one of the main moves in Banjo Kazooie. Ooh! It's basically just used as a higher jump. We thought it would be really cool as a up smash that also leaves you in the air. That way it could transition straight to aerial attacks. And that segues directly to... Ooh! I like that! That's interesting! The beat buster is basically a ground pound. That's a it cool idea! Not to use this as a down air. Yeah, this is the same. That's normal. The rat a tat rap is basically Banjo's bread and butter. He uses Bro, it everywhere he goes. I can't the believe they didn't put this in the game. Obviously, they had the back air where she pokes out of the back, but, like, this is the move. This is, like, the number one thing you hit when you play Banjo-Kazooie. They literally did. No, it's not the same. Back air is not this. Goes. Why does he the punch? sound effects were very important to us, and we were able to have them ripped straight from the game by Carl. You can check out his Twitch in the link above. Bro, that's actually kind of cool. It, like, drifts you on the ground? That happens in the real game, too. It's Look at this. Above. You see this? He's, like, drifting on the ground. That's kind of tight. I like that. Let's go, Carl! This is another original animation. Because all of the other moves are a little bit slower paced, we thought we needed one thing that was really quick. Okay, I like that one. Banjo can use his pack whack move in the air. We used a modified version of this for his back air. Ooh. Bro, that's sick! We used a modified version. Wait, so they just swapped bear and fair? It's the same thing, it's just reversed. One of this for his back air. Right? Like, I mean, back air is the big... And honestly, that's more in line with normal characters. Most characters have, like, a big, strong back air that you gotta, like, time. In a spammable kind of forward air, you know? I like that one better. The neutral air is from something a little bit different. There was a beta project called Project Dream, and whenever Banjo jumped, he always had this kind of skater jump to him every single time he would do that. Oh, you just so wanted to thought, give him... hey, let's use that. We also wanted All right, they were lazy. They came up they came up with this big explanation. This is just lazy as shit. This is just on Mario's rig. That's Mario. It's a sex kick. I just realized many of you might not know what a sex kick is and might be looking at the screen very strangely right now. Sex kick is uh is a fr I know. I know. <laughs> I know. I get it. I get it. Sex kick is a uh is a phrase in Smash. Where the idea is it it's a it's a move that that you use and it pops out immediately and it starts strong and then it gets weaker. I don't know why it's called a sex kick. I don't know who decided that, but that's just what it's called. Dr. Mario has a reverse sex kick where it gets stronger at the end. It's the same guy who named the shine the shine? Is that true? I didn't know that. Huh. Neat. I don't know a lot, bro. Like, the guy, JV? I never met JV. I don't know who he is. He's apparently not been in the scene forever, but... This move to be a little bit quicker since the other ones weren't. Yeah, no, they were lazy on that. One of the unique things about this move is you could use it to shoot both forward and backward. Ow. How would you... He didn't even tell me how. I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> Look at his face. Look at bit. He is so pleased. Wait till they get a load of this. I'm gonna take a shit. <laughs> Just dumping all over the opponent. He's so happy. It is a funny move. It's a very silly move. By the way, he has teeth, and I don't like that. That is weird. He has, like, human teeth, right? Ugh. What a big egg. Honestly, I like that so much better than, than Smash. I they win. Nothing made me more happy in Banjo. That's so much better. When I found a flight pad. Because Banjo's pretty heavy, you glide down pretty quick. But you can interrupt the flight with an attack. Whee! 
We really try to mimic that mechanic. Oh, dude. That's probably broken, right? That's probably broken. You the flight with an attack. There's no way that's not broken. We really try Bro, if Banjo can up B anywhere on the stage and just start flying around, maybe maybe he can't turn around. Cuz if it's PM glide rules, right? Try to mimic that mechanic. It's just game and what? Yeah, okay, so we can't turn around. You saw him drift back we there? Really try to mimic that mechanic. Yeah. Dude, that seems toxic. But very funny. And speaking of attacks while flying, the beak bomb you can use by hitting side B, and it's a very long Dude. range and powerful attack. But if you that miss, and you so it's like Charizard or the ground, it could actually hurt you. <laughs> but be careful if you're too close to the edge. But be if careful. You miss and you go out there, it's really difficult to fly back. Bro, that is amazing. I love just giving DDD a concussion. Donk! <laughs> that piss me off. Ow! Ow! But be careful if you're too close to the edge. Oh, that's funny. If you miss and you go out there, it's really difficult to fly back. Down that's cool, dude. That's so much better Sometimes than what we got. Sometimes when making a moveset, I really try hard to just go a little extra. Yeah. Sometimes it works out good, and sometimes it kind of doesn't. <laughs> special. What? Wait, what was that? Sometimes it works out good. There's a toad? Sometimes... There's a toad? I want to watch this next. This has nothing to do with my, my programming tonight, but I want to watch this. Sometimes it kind of doesn't. <laughs> Fucking turnip cannon? Blast off! For the down special, I thought the talent trot would be pretty sweet. In the game, it's used to go faster and go up hills he normally can't. Uh -huh. It could also interrupt into other attacks. Uh huh. Don't make this overloaded. But what's even cooler is it can unlock additional abilities as well. When they use the uh... jump pad, it works in two steps. First, they do the initial jump, and then they do the big jump right after. I'm starting to get fanboy vibes from this move set. I'm starting to get worried. I don't know. This is almost too faithful, right? It's getting complicated. Don't you think so? I, I think I think he's starting to lose me. Isn't that the point? No. There's a point where, like, you got to make a Smash character. But if you make them overbaked or too much, it gets a little, like, uh, it's a little much. What's Banjo's also cool a simple is character. Go to an aerial attack right after. I think Here that's kind of cool, set, though. I, yeah, but Talent Trot isn't a stance change move in Banjo. That's what I'm saying. It's not even faithful to his game. It just feels like the guy wanted to make a new set of moves. You know what I mean? I don't know, bro. Sonic OC Syndrome? I don't know. I'm just, I'm a little worried. We'll continue watching. Basically do the I don't exact know. same thing with just a little bit extra. <laughs> okay, you can't tell me that's not DLC. Come on. He, he, bro, what is that? You could ground him? What was I just saying? What did I just say? He has a berry jump? Why? That never happens in Banjo. <laughs> See? I, you guys, I'm just, you get what I'm saying now, right? This sounds fun until it happens to you. You can also jump on them in the air. But be careful not to miss, because if you miss, you won't come back. So the talent trot <laughs> will so unlock sad. that move, and it will oh my also God. unlock several other moves so fast. as well. We oh, have not several animated other moves. these yet, and like I said, the motivation has been a little bit down ever since Banjo was announced. But the team I've been able to work with has been incredible. I'm happy to have been able to have gotten this far. I don't know exactly where it's going to go from here, but one thing that I do know for sure is that we plan on making Banjo public this week. And the reason why is because we don't want to keep him held back. That way, oh. maybe new talent will come in and help us animate. We don't know cool. exactly. Anyway, I'm very grateful that you've been able to watch this really long video. There's I'm other pro Bro, it's six minutes. ...projects that are in the works, and... I hope to be able to show you some really cool stuff soon as well. Good movie. Uh, what the hell was that side B? Look at this. And Look how fast this is. And I hope to be able Whoosh. to show you some really <laughs> cool stuff soon. Banjo should not be able to recover for that. If Banjo misses this move, he should die. Projects that are in the works. Look at this. And I hope to be. Bro, that's so fast.
be able to show you some really cool stuff soon as well. Anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Dude, I feel so bad. He was so sad, he didn't even hit subscribe. That's so sad. He's so heartbroken about Banjo coming out. Oh, no. That's tough. Okay, so now that we've watched this video, I ask you guys, who did, oh, did I not save it? So this nerd put Sakurai, or put Banjo, let me do that again for, hold on. Okay. This nerd put Banjo in Super Smash Brothers, but did he do a better job than Sakurai himself. Hmm. Both bad? I, you know? I think this is a point for... Wow, at all the ones. Are you guys serious? Sakurai w got... Okay. Guys. What do you mean? Got... Okay, I thought this would have been a lock. I can't believe this is at all close. Are you kidding me? Banjo and Smash is so boring. The viewers are counting graphics. Wait, don't count graphics. Graphics don't matter. This is purely moveset. Who delivered the vision of Banjo-Kazooie in Super Smash Brothers better? Sakurai or the nerd? The nerd who made Banjo. Hmm? Ultimate Banjo is so dull. Sakurai, I don't even know if he played the game, bro. They're both faithful to Banjo. No, they're not! Okay, maybe I... Okay, I'm biased on this one. What's crazy is that you guys did the poll. 54% say go to the nerd and 46% and, and say Sakurai. It didn't matter what you chose, though. Because either way, I'm deciding this one. And nerd wins. I will never forgive Sakurai for doing this. Ever. Sincerely. I'm mad at him. And I'll stay mad at him for the rest of my life. I'm not kidding. Wait, how do I grab the... Okay, there it is. Grab this. Sakurai killed my favorite character. And made him a shitty, egg-shitting loser. Bro, and, and do you notice a pattern here, by the way? All the Western characters over here. Hmm? You're a big baby, Coney. Well, even a big baby is right twice a day. Stupid. Sakurai killed my favorite character. No, Steve isn't a Western character. Steve is from Europe. So. Wait, Banjo's from Europe. Well, Banjo's from Britain, which I think is west of Sweden. Hmm. True. <laughs> Literally true. Technically correct. Banjo is from the West, and Steve is an Eastern character. And I'm glad that we can agree. I'm glad that we agree on this. Yep. There is a distinction, and it's important. Okay. So with that out of the way, Nerd wins a point, because of course he does. But now comes another fan favorite that was actually highly requested for quite a while. It's another Project M mod, because that's the only way we can do this fucking series. Unless we do Smash Flash, which Omega laugh. Uh, let's take What's a look up, at guys? Ridley. It's Aaron Nitmar, and now Ridley was brought into Smash after much request and deliberation. Uh, a lot of people said he'd be too big for the game, too crazy, but they put him into Legacy XP 2.0. I don't know. I'm going to say it was Project M. Video by our good friend Aaron Itmar. Let's take a look at what happens here. Welcome back to Super Smash Bros. Legacy XP 2.0. Now, I did look at this video. He actually goes through all the moves, so we'll be able to see what the... I didn't watch it all the way, but I, like, pieced through. We'll be able to see the moves as they come out. I saw, like, the jab, and I was like, okay, he'll go through everything.
deathmatch because now he's a fighter rather than a stage hazard or a boss character but he still has quite a bit of range to him so let's go ahead and take a look at Whoa, his he looks set. crazy ridley's wait hold on before we even get started wait what is this back air dude okay i might cancel this i might have to cancel this uh <laughs> this segment i think sakurai wins because Sakurai would not make a move like this. This is insane. Oh my god. How do you get in on this move? What the fuck? Is his tongue out? It is. Ugh. Charizard? That's not the same. That's not the same. By the way, Keith, what are you doing with that crown? Use that prime right now. What are you doing with that crown? Use that prime this instant. Keith, you dropped that Prime this instant. <laughs> I see you with the Prime in the chat. Use it this instant, right now. I'm not starting the stream until you do it. Thank you, Simbad. Y'all take Simbads. Thank you, Death Poser. I'll start the stream. It's fine. Someone did it. Thank you, Chacky. You got... Oh, my God. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Okay, I got three crowns. That's worth one Keith crown. We're fine. Ridley's jab combo is a three-hit move. <laughs> that kick... The first two moves have Ridley slashing with his claws, and the final hit, he spins around <laughs> and hits spin? his opponent with his tail. Ridley's dash attack is a claw swipe up, which Ooh. knocks the opponent up into the air. Uh, what's Ridley's thing now? It's the bite, right? Low to the ground? Mm. Now let's look at Ridley's tail. Guys, don't, okay, don't look at the animations or the graphics or anything like that. Thank you, Econthon. Don't look at anything visual, okay? We're looking at the soul. Okay? It's not just skin deep. Tilts. First is moves. forward tilt, which is a swipe up with this. Okay, that's fucking great. Never mind. This is absurd. What are you doing? This guy must love Ridley. Whoever made this loves Ridley. This is insane. This character must be the lightest character in the game. He better be. Up with his tail. Now, something important to note is that any move that uses Ridley's tail has a basic tipper mechanic involved. Oh my god. If you hit the move with exactly the arrow barb part of the tail, He's a it's fan going boy. to deal a lot more damage He's a fan and boy character. than if you hit it with another part of the tail. So sometimes you actually do oh want to hit god. with the weak side of the tail simply because it kind of combos better. But if you want more damage and knockback, you have to use the arrow part of the tail. Okay. He with is that big said, though. Let's next look at you know, Ridley's he's got the reptar which problem. Which is a fire breath move upwards. This move actually hits on both sides, so you can even be facing away from the opponent and you'll still hit the move. That's fast. And finally, down tilt, which is a sweep the leg move with Ridley's tail. Sure. Next okay. up, let's do smash attacks. Yeah. First is forward smash, which has Ridley stab forward <laughs> with his tail. This kind of little twirl. Does he ever do that in a Metroid game? Kind of reminds me of Corrin's forward smash from it's Smash It's so 4, fancy. Especially considering <laughs> it has a tipper involved. Up smash is a two hit move. The first hit knocks the opponent <laughs> above Ridley and is meant to... I don't know why seeing Ridley with his uh, with his wings closed is so funny to me. I don't know why that's so funny. What kind, What sound would it make? <laughs> Look at his walk. Did he walk? I didn't Ford see it. Smash from Smash 4, especially considering it has a tip. <laughs> okay, he walks like a stop motion character. I don't know if I like that. He walks like Rudolph in the animated special. Like, I, I, it's not. He's like a monster from one of the old 1930s movies. Hold on. <laughs> Have you guys ever seen that Sinbad movie with the stop motion animation? Yeah, this is Ridley. <laughs> from the seventh voyage of Sinbad. <laughs> there he goes. Oh god. It reminds me of Corrin's forward smash, doom, smash doom, which has doom. Ridley stab forward with though, his tail. This kind of reminds fitting. me of pretty Corrin's fitting. forward smash from Smash 4, especially considering it has a tipper. I like it. I like that. Up smash is a two hit move. The first hit knocks the opponent Ooh. above Ridley and is meant to link into the second more powerful hit where the wings come together. 
this is another move, just like up tilt, That's where you can hit big. it on both sides. And How much did that do? This is another move, just like. 13 for both hits? Not crazy. Like up tilt, where you Kinda can hit sucks, it on both actually. sides, no matter which direction you're facing. Mm -hmm. And then there's down smash, which has Ridley spin his tail around and hit the opponent. Kony, would you be interested in seeing someone recreate Banjo-Kazooie worlds in survival Minecraft? No. Now let's tackle Ridley's grab, pummel, and throw. Thank you for asking, though. Up throw bites the opponent I don't like and then throws them into the air. Forward throw slams the opponent into the ground and then sends on, and then throws it. him into pummel and throw. What's his what's his pummel? Oh, he bites. Now let's tackle Ridley's grab, chomp, pummel, chomp. and throws. Up throw bites the opponent and then throws them into the air. Uh -huh. Forward throw slams the opponent into the ground and then sends them flying. <laughs> Dude, that's actually a rock Forward bottom. Forward throw slams the opponent into the ground and then... This is a fucking rock bottom. Oh, boom. Oh, my God. Look at that! Sends them flying. Down throw has Ridley breathe a fire in a circle around the opponent. And oh, that's slams tight. Into them, which sends them that's a cool move. Oh, I like that. That's really and good. And back throw stabs the opponent with Ridley's tail and uses the tail to throw them back. That down throw is tight. I Next, like that. Let's look at Ridley's aerials. Oh, Ridley no. He has Wolf Nair. He has Wolf Nair. <laughs> up a decent amount of damage. Ridley's up oh, air God. is a slash upward. Bro, so, Wolf Neutral Air is so funny because he does a big ass spin. For what? It does nothing. It does no damage. Decent amount of damage. Oh, it's screw attack. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool, actually, because it's like thematic. Like how all the pit characters, like Polytana Pit, they all have like the rotating. That's kind of cool if he has that. I like that. Ridley's up air is a slash upward, which oh, is he's really, wolf. really good. Bro, that's literally Wolf's up air in Brawl. Damage. Ridley's up air is a slash upward, that's actually which is just really, wolf. really good for juggling the opponent. It kind of reminds me of Meta Knight's up air, but much bigger because Ridley is like three times the size of Meta Knight. Dude, Aaron Hitmar is a really good voice for this. He's good at YouTube, bro. Forward air is he's, an aerial this video slash. Is bro, like it's Wolf! You made Wolf! You made Wolf! What are you doing? How did you... Okay. Dude, what was Wolf's fare in Brawl? I don't remember. Was it just this? I think it was that, but slow, right? Like Smash 4 it was Charizard's that. forward air. It's Wolf. Uh, bro, Aaron is trying so hard not to say Wolf. This is a lot like Charizard. The upper's a lot like Meta Knight. I, I think there's another character I'm thinking of. Down air sends Ridley flying okay, down that's really not fast <laughs> and then stabs the opponent with his tail. Oh, God. If the opponent isn't good at DI or teching, you can get quite a few hits Boom. off of repeatedly Boom. using this move. Boom. And finally, back air, which is an upward sweep of oh, Ridley's that's, tail. That's bad. And now let's get into Ridley's special moves. Dude, upward this is this is a war crime. Tail. If I lose to this in tournament, I'm going to only lose to this move. You literally cannot play a Mario brother against this character. You cannot play a Mario brother. At all. You, if you play any character that has to fight straight up with, with his face, you lose. And now let's get as a as a connoisseur of the Mario Brother characters, fuck Ridley. To Ridley's special moves. First up is Neutral B, which is a chargeable fireball. This move is basically like Samus. Except Luigi, I hate Luigi. Hard shot. It can be canceled at any time, and it can be saved as long as you don't get hit while you're charging it. That's kind of cool that there are thematic Side B elements is a between grab, Samus where Ridley and Ridley. That's forward and grabs the opponent. Oh, you shit. did have some form of control while holding the enemy, and you can fly in all directions. Once you're holding the enemy, you basically have four different aerial throws that you can do, all dependent on which direction you're holding when you press the A button. Okay, this seems cool until Ridley grabs you at 90 and escorts you to the blast zone. That might be a problem. It's If this is a command grab cargo throw, we have a problem. It's an aerial Congo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I, don't know if we want an aerial cargo throw. Ridley is taking you to the second location. <laughs> Never go to the second location. Pressing A while holding forward simply chucks the opponent. This and lets seems them go. fun until you break Pressing your controller from mashing. Up, throws the opponent upward and can set up for aerial juggles. A while holding back, of course, just throws the opponent backwards. And A while holding down brings the opponent up to Ridley's <laughs> mouth. Hits them with his fire breath. Yeah, you want to fight this in tournament? 
You want to fight this in tournament? You think that's balanced? A bit strong, you think? And a grabbed Samus at zero, oh, holding down, and she couldn't come back. Up to Ridley's mouth, hits. Bro, zero percent. When did she? When could she jump? When could she jump? At what point could Samus jump? Here? <laughs> oh my god. This is Samus's first, first active frame. I can't even see her. Where's Samus? Little Mac dead at one. <laughs> Little Mac would take, Little Mac is at 11% when he dies. Where's Samus? She's gone. She has succumbed to the depths of Zebus or wherever the hell planet this is. That's insane. Ridley's mouth hits them with his fire breath and then spikes the opponent downward. In my That's opinion, insane. aerial down throw is probably the best one. You th yeah, I, in my opinion too. My uh, Hey, I happen to think so too. We agree. Ridley's up B is really similar to Meta Knight's shuttle loop. <laughs> Could you guys see that? Was I in the way? Was I in the way for that? I want you to get the full experience. Ridley Please watch this. One. Look at how Ridley's elegant he is. is really similar to Meta Knight's shuttle loop. <laughs> Beautiful. Majestic. Like a goose. Ridley does a sort Gorgeous. of somersault in the air and then propels Beautiful. himself upward. Whoop! While this isn't a I great recovery move because Ridley also has like four jumps, the bigger deal is that this move recovery move <laughs> because Ridley also has like... <laughs> Bro, you cannot hold on to the ledges, Ridley. You are going to get fucking jammed. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> your head is so high up. You could forward smash angle up on this. Mario could forward smash this way and it would hit you right on the nose. Oh my god. He's so large. Marth F smash would like go through your brain. <laughs> it would be like <laughs> just dissect your head. God, that's how he's balanced. You just keep Ridley at the ledge. Hey, this is PM though. No, in PM, it's you can grab the ledge as much as you want. There's no trumping. Ledge of its ability is there, you know? I think. I don't remember. It's been years since I played BM. Four jumps. The bigger deal is that this move is actually a really powerful kill move. It's got high knockback, so even at mid move is actually a really powerful. At 120? Is that really popular or really powerful? 120 is really powerful? I feel like... I saw Ridley kill at zero. Kill move. So it's got high knockback. So even at mid to high percent, it can send your opponent very far. He can't grab ledge backwards. Ridley's down B has two different forms: a grounded form and an aerial form. Okay. While grounded, Ridley launches himself forward with his mouth open and hits the opponent with his head. Sure. While in the air, boring, Ridley performs but... a dive all the way down. This move reminds me a lot of Bowser's down B, Bowser Bomb, but you can only do it in the air. Why wouldn't that ju That's the same as his down air, right? It's just one of them pokes and one of them does that. I guess Bowser is the same thing, right? A lot of Bowser Yeah, that's his actual down air. That's that's just from Ultimate. Bowser's down B, Bowser bomb, but you can only down do it B in the sucks. air. Down B sucks, yeah. It's just now Bowser, I guess. Now Ridley's taunts. Ridley actually only has two taunts programmed. Fringe. Both up taunt and down taunt are the same, where Ridley <laughs> shrieks to the sky and sound waves come out of his mouth. Cool. And then there's side taunt where Ridley flaps his wings and then roars. Cool. Finally, Ridley's final smash is oh, a shit. gigantic beam of fire, which has amazing knockback and can kill even at mid percents. Neat. And that is a very quick overview of Ridley. Uh, wait, is now, she dead? I really think that this is a cool moveset, and it's really neat Bro. to see overview of Ridley. Now, I really think that- What do you do here? Ridley grabs you, throws you to the ground in a tech situation. What do you do? You can tech, but he's going to jump and get whatever you go for, right? This is an easy follow-up. 
If that command grab goes through shield, this character is insane. Oh my god. Bro, I, okay. I'll let you guys vote. So this version of Ridley... Wait. There's only six minutes? What's the rest? The cool moveset. And it's really neat to see Ridley in some form in Smash Brothers as a fighter rather than a stage hazard or a boss character. I thought we were at the but end. But honestly, and I know you guys are going to disagree with me because I know I have a lot of Ridley fans, but I, it still just seems too big for Smash. Now, I know that this he model does look is very about large. the size of Charizard, if just slightly bigger, and so that doesn't look like it's a big deal, but his tail is scrunched up half the time, <laughs> and a lot of his moves still have, like, a ridiculous range to them. Yes. Like, for example, his up smash has a huge range. His up yeah, tail, his back I think he's, I, a it's not even a meme. He's too big. He have a huge range, and the way that Ridley is modeled, he, so, he seems almost scrunched up until he needs to do a move. <laughs> so while he doesn't look too big just standing there, when you he's actually like an accordion. get into, like, what his moves do, and making it a faithful recreation of Ridley from the games into a Smash Fighter, he just seems like he would be completely overpowered. True. And then there's the other side where if they were to put him into the game, they would probably try and make his moveset do a lot less damage and knockback or make it just a lot less range. Yeah, true. And then he sucks, which is what we got. All right. Uh, so who did better? Could it be Ridley or was it Sakurai? Who succeeded more? in bringing the vision of Ridley to life. Everybody wanted this character for years and years. Bro, Sakurai about to get another dub. That's insane. Wow. Two on principle? <laughs> I mean, like, I think Ridley's pretty faithful, right? In, in Ultimate. He's just, like, not good. But is he... Why is Sora here? But is he supposed to be good? I feel like it's okay that Ridley is canonically bad. You know what I'm saying? I don't expect Ridley to be the best character in the game. None of you voting to would ever play the game with that Ridley. Yeah, if I fought that PM Ridley, I would probably be perma mad. All the time. A lot. I I play Wario in PM. Seems like a disaster. Thank you, Kyle the Meme Magnet. Now, I want to see this Toad move set. Hold on. I'm just curious now. Move set showcase. It's eight minutes. We'll watch this after. We'll watch this in between. Because I have a few more things. I want you guys to know how hard it is. Oh, I see. I was like, what was that? I want you guys to know how hard it is to find videos for this series, okay? I'm going to take you on a journey for this next one. So, for this next one, I really wanted to reach back, to dial back the hands of time, and say, okay, we know all of these characters that came in Ultimate were highly requested, and people wanted them forever. And a lot of them finally got into the game to varying degrees of success. But who's a character that's even older that people have wanted? And I looked around, but you would not believe how hard it was to find. Here's an example. Little Mac fan moveset. Uh, there's, there's a lot of, there's Project M, but obviously this came out four years ago. And when I'm doing this, I'm trying to find movesets from before they were in Smash 4. Do you know what I mean? I'm trying to find older movesets with the aim of a brand new idea from somebody making the game. The nerd needs to inspire himself. He can't just see what Sakurai does and make his moveset. So I looked for Little Mac, couldn't find it. I looked for Mega Man. I thought I found it. Uh, there's actually, uh, I did this. There is Mega Man in Project M, and I was like, oh, perfect. But no, this is just Smash 4 Mega Man, but in PM. It's the same moveset. And I'm like, damn, that kind of sucks. It's not the same thing. 
Um, I looked around a bunch. Now, there was one character that was a newcomer in Smash 4 in 2014 that a lot of people were speculating about and wanted to see in the game. There was only one I could find. Can you guess who it is? If you do before a year in the search bar, it shows a certain year. See, what I did was this. I would do Little Mac fan moveset, and I would go like this, upload date, and then it would say nothing like that. There was one character in Smash 4 that people really wanted to see in the game, and they made fan-made movesets. Can you guess who it is? I don't think you're going to guess. I found a lot of videos for this character, and I had to pick one. <laughs> Oh, no, I picked the wrong one. Hold on. I found, I picked the wrong video because I wanted to do a different one. <laughs> okay, perfect. Good. Okay. That character is Bowser Jr. There are so many Bowser Jr. movesets made by fans. Ten years ago. Nine years ago, 11 years ago, I think these are the same video. <laughs> 11 years ago, 10 years ago, bro, they're everywhere. It's crazy. These are just made by children. Uh, but, you know, let's, let's, let's dial back the hands of time and let's watch an old moveset uh, speculation and let's see how close they got it. Would we rather be in this reality where this junior made it to the game or the reality we live in now? By the way, I forgot to give Sakurai the point. Editor, cut this part. <laughs> All right, let's let's go back in time, guys. We're going to go back in time. Pretend like we didn't just do the Bowser Jr. part. Please don't spoil it in the back. I forgot to do this. It seems as though Chad has decided, and I think rightfully so, Ridley goes to Sakurai. Sakurai wins this one. Sakurai wins this one for sure. I, he has to. He has to. The other one is just too big. Nerd made him too big. What a classic mistake. What a dork. Look at him right there. Insane. Okay. <laughs> All right. Back to Bowser. All right. Uh, <laughs> I, I got to be honest. I had a different video in mind. I did not watch this one. I did not pre-screen this. So, if something comes up that I get banned for, I'm sorry. This is from 2010. <laughs> Many of you weren't born yet. Uh, is there no music? Is there not any music? Uh, I'll play music. Oh, no. <laughs> it's because I muted the site. My bad. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. There he is. He was in both ears. Normal attacks. He uses his magic paintbrush, hammer, and shell to fight mostly. He fights with his paintbrush to make basic attacks. See the pictures for examples. Okay. Yeah, so he's out of his car. Right? That's fine. That makes sense. Okay. Fire Breath is similar to the one of Bowser's, only the one from Junior starts up slower, but the duration is longer. Okay. So, same neutral B. It's just a small Bowser right now. Hmm. Uses hammer, smashes forward to an opponent. He can also deflect projectiles, and it will stop fire moves. Why fire moves specifically? Why only fire? This seems pretty bad. Whirling for okay, down B is the same instead of up B for Bowser. It's down okay, this video. I'm starting to think this video is made by a child. <laughs> up special. He goes into his clown car and spins upwards. While going upwards, you can rotate it a little. If he reached his high point, it disappears and falls down. 
Okay. And a final sm d no no smash attacks here. We only have specials. Swing move. Sonic. R What's a swing move? <laughs> what game is he playing? Extra things. Bowser Jr.'s grab is that he will make a spin with his paintbrush. Anyone who gets in it is stuck. The person who made this is 25 now. Isn't that crazy? Hey, if you made this and you're watching, drop a prime. You're welcome for the exposure. <laughs> Great movie. Okay, I did not pre-screen this one. Uh... Let's try this one. Paintbrush spin. Bowser Jr. spins with the paintbrush. This does 12 to 14. Now we're getting exact with the numbers. That's pretty good. <laughs> yep. Bowser Jr. side B attack. He throws the basketball in the air like Yoshi egg throw. Cool. B side attack. Bowser Jr. charges the soccer ball. But I thought he did the egg throw. Oh, they're... Okay. He has two side Bs. Two side Bs. Fine. Why not? That's okay. That's a, I'll let him have two side Bs. Up B attack. Bowser Jr. goes into his shell and does a big hop. Sure. Yup. Down B attack. Bowser Jr. transform into Shadow Mario. Oh! A Zelda Sheik style. Okay. He spins the brush and this works as a shield. Okay. Yeah. Shadow Mario B-side movie throws this... It. <laughs> he didn't know what to call these. He throws this. Whatever this is. Whatever, whatever the hell this thing is. Yeah, he throws that. <laughs> Shadow Mario Uppy, he grabs whatever character jumps and throws them down. If there is no character, he just jumps. That makes sense. Sure. Yeah. Yup. Yeah. This is how he grabs them. Cool. Good detail. Good detail orientation. Yeah, I know. I assume. Thank you. Not the ship again. These guys love the ship. This is how he looks when he's using the final smash. <laughs> Bro, kids love, but not credits again. Not more cre Wait, to who? What? There's no credits. <laughs> There's no credits. Okay, uh, we'll, we'll get Bowser Jr. one more try. One more try. Uh, this one is 112 views from 2010. Hello, my name is Fjorn Fan, and I'm going to represent the moveset of Bowser Jr. Oh, okay. His A moveset will be a mix up between. This is like a call in Five Nights at Freddy's. Bowser's and Squirrel. A standout B. Will be fire. I'm gonna get jump scared. There's kind of a small fireball out of his mouth. Yeah. But sometimes there only comes smoke out of his mouth. Oh. And Junior will say something like, oops. <laughs> okay. Yeah. But also sometimes. That'd be funny. The small fireball explodes. Ah! In a real huge mass of fire. Okay. All right, some RNG elements. I like that. Some RNG elements. Some critical damage. Sure. Opponent. Not bad. I like that. Will be shells. Oh, we character. upgraded the mic. Okay. He go inside his shell and rolls tower to the opponent. And he also makes them dizzy. Okay, uh, so that's like egg roll. Let's think about that. That's He did egg roll. He did side B. His up B will be scratching ball. He jumps up and raises hands. But the regal attack starts 
when you reach the highest top of a smooth, uh -huh. on his way downwards, he scratch everything what in his way. <laughs> so he so he goes up in the air and then he scratches the hell out of stuff coming down. Okay, that sure, be, sure. Okay. Be transformation. Oh, does he turn into Shadow Mario? It make him able to turn into Shadow Mario. Yeah! Cohesion! Shadow Mario <laughs> is similar to the no normal Mario. Amazing. I love it. Just as a brush. With the used for the mouth of his aims. So he, he's the same as regular Mario. Okay. The standard B move will be paintball. Okay. He shoots a ball of paint. Onto his opponents. Sure. The fire rate of this move is really high, but if you use it too long or too often, the brush runs dry, and you can use it for a while. Dude, that's Inkling. He just called Inkling. That's insane. You j you can fire a bunch of paint, but you can run out. <laughs> this Damn. Will be this guy might work for Nintendo. He jumps forward, smash the brush into the crowd. Yeah. And a puddle of color appears. This puddle works like the oil spot from the Mario Kart series. <laughs> okay. His up will be brush jump. He perform a pole vault. Then he attack similar to Mars with a slash. Okay. This down B will be also. And he turns back. He turns back. Okay, so sure. To turn back to if Bowser Jr. sucks, you could play Shadow Mario. That's true. Now you get double the chances. Final smash. Does he have the ship? What do you think? Is the final smash the ship? <laughs> I, I, I want to run the predictions so bad, but people will cheat. Bowser Jr. and Shadow Mario will both have final smash on their own. Uh huh. At first, we come to. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Get in the ship! I love that. Why do they love the ship so much? Oh, the they smart. love the ship, bro. They Pickle love the ship. ship is that why kid, bro? Is there That's something cool. to kid? Okay, be honest with me. Kids love tails. Kids love Bowser Jr. Is there something with like transportation? Is it some like planes, trains, and automobile stuff? Seriously. It's gotta be something. Kids love vehicles. I think so. Lots and lots of trains. It's gotta be. Ball of airship appears in the background and began to shoot with bully willies at your opponent. The number is related to the size of the stage you fight on. Sure. At least we come to Shadow Mario's final smash. Did he record these at different times? A huge brush appears and it flutes every platform of the stage. The color makes it impossible for your opponents to move normal. Okay. In other words, it's really easy for you to knock them out. Okay. I now, I guess that that means only one thing left to do. What? I have to thank you uh -oh. for watching my wit. Thank you. And I would be thankful if you, if you would believe some commands, what I could make better, if you like oh. the move sets, and so on. Great movie, great movie. But is it a good character? That's for you to decide. <laughs> now I don't really know how to structure this. Uh. If you put all of the best ideas together from all three of those children, what kind of character does it make? I think Nerd wins by pure virtue of not putting him in the clown car. Right? Everything is better than not being than being in the clown car. That's it. As long as he's not in the clown car, I'm happy. That's it. I like the airship. I you know, I, I how are you allowed to be on Twitch? Are you old enough to be on this site? I'm going to need your see your parents' permission slip to continue viewing. <laughs> if you like the ship, you might be underage. Why do they like the airship so much? It was just, I had to show you guys 
li literally, when I was doing the research for this segment, I could not believe how hard it was to find a move set for any character, like a fan made one before they came out, other than Bowser Jr. Bowser Jr. was so easy. Everybody else was so hard. Okay. I think it's pretty clear that Nerd wins on this. Of course. Of course he does. And again, I don't even know if Nerd wins. I think Sakurai just loses. So, the fan-made junior movesets are... Whoops. The fan-made junior movesets are better. They just are. Well done to the Nerd. Congratulations. It's four to three now. Hmm. Kind of interesting. Mm, might need something to shake things up a bit. Now, <laughs> this last one. Gonna go a little bit outside the box on this. Now, this series is primarily interested in who did existing movesets better. But what if we're critiquing a decision of Sakurai's? What if instead of the movesets, we're looking at the choice to include a character at all. Should Gino have been in the game? Did we deserve Gino? How cool will he have been? Did we miss out? Let's find out. Now the question here did Sakurai make the right decision by not adding this character? Or did the nerd make the right decision by making something cool? Let's take a look. Maybe it's good. I don't know. Bro, I haven't watched this. I actually don't know what he does. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> he started the match with a nest taunt. He immediately did a nest taunt. That's that's a bad sign. Up throw. Okay. Up air. Wait. Oh, he has me gunner forward air? He looks kind of stubby. Mega Man down air. Okay. Bro. Okay, hold on. These are the aerials. This looks kind of fun. He is just me, Gunner. <laughs> I don't know, dude. This looks kind of fun. Hold on. Okay, so the aerials. Let's go through the aerials. Hold on. Neutral air. Boring. Sex kick. Whatever. Oh, boy. Wood. <laughs> He's a puppet. He's a puppet of the stars. Can you be nice to him? Come on. He is a puppet boy from space or something. I don't know. He fulfills dreams. He wishes to be a re I never realized that Gino is Pinocchio. Is Gino Pinocchio? Huh. I never really thought of that. All right. It's a star possessing a toy. <laughs> Okay, whatever. All right, neutral air is a kick. That's kind of boring. Forward air is me gunner, but that's kind of cool, right? Isn't that kind of cool? I think that looks kind of cool. Up air is a... Uh, okay, yeah. Combo move. Back air, dude. I don't know. And down air is Gunner. Okay. Is that down smash? Okay, down smash is just a normal spin -a Sure. My dream is for Gino to fuck off. Okay, guys, he's gone forever. Can you be nice to him? He's already gone. We're just going to see if he deserved to be in the game. Can you give him one last chance? Oh, that's a cool taunt. Isn't that a cool taunt? He lit he fucks off. He fulfills your dream. He dies. Look. 
Hold B for pat. Dude, that's cool. Dude, that's a cool move. That move is so much fun. It looks cool. Right? No, it isn't. What are you talking about? A move where you can charge a shot that comes down like that? Gino World. Press B with the right timing. Oh, sh oh, wait. I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that. So you could, you could call down stars or shoot a boomerang? Oh, and it explodes. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know if I like that. Oh, no. Maybe not. Down throw. New special cannonball. Bro! <laughs> Bro, that actually looks kind of fun. That looks mad fun. Wait. Bro, hold on. Maybe Gino's tight. We, I kind of wish he was in the game. Bro, you just blast off? What move is that? Is that down tilt? What is this? Why does it linger? <laughs> All right. I, you know, this is kind of cool. I don't care about the game. I don't care about that. Oh, wait. What? Well, that was kind of cool, I guess. Oh, that's down tilt is the, is the star thing. He sends a star out. Oh, that's kind of neat. That's actually kind of neat. Because it, like, pokes out there? Before it smashes the big fist? The star is him? Oh, you're right. That's, like, his soul, right? Bro, look at the angle on that. Look at the angle on this. Bro, it hits up here? It's, uh, it's Banjo. <laughs> Douche. <laughs> you can cannon in the air. This would piss me off. This would make me so mad. I'm trying to juggle Gino and he just blasts down into me. Dude. This is kind of... Okay, what was that clip? <laughs> this clip is just a forward throw into an up air. Or back air into an up air. <laughs> Wait, was that up smash? Wait. Wait, wait. I don't think I like this anymore. Final Smash? No, it's not. Final Smash Alt? Oh, okay. I I don't think it's Final Smash, is it? He's not glowing. Final Smash is directional? It is Final Smash. Okay. Okay. Okay, then that's that that's not crazy then. Okay. So I don't know, bro. This looks pretty fun. This Gino Blast move looks so fun to combo with. All right. I don't want to sway the vote at all. This does have 400,000 views. Damn, 400,000 views with 700 subs. This is the importance of CTAs. This is why you should always tell people to like, comment, and subscribe. This is why it's important to tell people to go below the video, any video on YouTube, and remember to like the video, subscribe, and to comment on every video you watch on YouTube. Very important to do that. Always. So, I don't want to sway the vote too much. But, uh... It's now up to you. Who had the right idea? Should we have ever gotten Gino in the game? <laughs> or was Sakurai right in his decision to leave a side character from a 25-year-old game out of the main franchise? Again, I don't want to split the vote, but that looked kind of fun, bro. 
that move set, that's years of passion. And you you know if we got Gino, he would not have been that cool. He would not have been that cool. Can we put this move set on me, Gunner? That would be fucked up. <laughs> just just taking that whole move set and adopting it to the me. Oh no. That's so sad. All I would want is the cannon? Really? All right. Nerd wins. Which means... Get to add my little buddy right here. Congratulations to Gino. We're all tied up. Four apiece! Four apiece, bro! I don't know. Maybe Sakurai is a hack. Maybe Sakurai doesn't actually know what he's doing, bro. You know what I mean? If all these other people with no training and no direction and just learning how to make custom moves can make a moveset better than a professional game developer, I don't know. It's even so far. That's tough. Well, maybe we'll see uh, with the rest of these characters. I have no idea how to do the rest. <laughs> I have no idea if we'll see more of this series. I, it's kind of slim pickings at this point to try to find the characters. But hey, what do you think? Did it, we get it wrong? Is chat wrong on some of these answers? I, I kind of agree with chat 100%. But YouTube's kind of dumb, so maybe you won't agree. Comment below, and hey, be sure to leave a like. It'll, it'll help the video, and it'll make you feel better. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, we'll see you next time. Say bye, chat. Bye, YouTube. Goodbye. Goodbye. You say bye. Say bye. I hate it when you guys take so long. Bye, YouTube. Goodbye. Bye. I don't know if we can ever do this again. Do you guys know how long it took me to find these videos? Harder than you would think to find this stuff. <laughs> I'm running out of characters. Damn, Sakurai really is great at JRPG guys and shit at Scrimblo. Yeah, well, he just, he likes what he likes. He likes the games he likes. I like this series a lot, but I have no idea how to do, like... You could get into the territory of, like, reworks, I guess. On, like, Mario, DK. Because, like, people say, you know, they deserve a rework. But, like, what's the angle there? You know? Tough. YouTube has no idea why you say it'll make you feel better. I'm just stealing that. I'm stealing it outright. It's a great bit. I love it. It'll make you feel better. Oh, you got... I kind of want to watch the Toad moveset. I forgot about that. You might have to resort to images. Then I'm not making a series. If I can't do a video, if everything is the junior video, then I'm not... It's not gonna work, you know? How is Gino? Have you guys tried Gino in PM? He actually genuinely looks really fun. You could absolutely find old forum fan movesets. Yeah, but like forum movesets aren't good for this. Forum movesets don't work here, because like... That's not for YouTube, you know? Thank you, Mega Mew. Thank oh my god, my mouth. Thank you, Mega Mew Art. My brain outran my tongue. Gino is sick in PM? Maybe we should have gotten him, bro. If they made him that good. I don't know. Okay. So. Next up. Hmm. How do I want to do this? Like I said, we have three things we're doing tonight. But that one went kind of long. It's already ten. Fuck it, I'll do both. We go long tonight. Oh, maybe. Maybe I'll do the next one Sunday. Who knows? I watched streams for one second and the streamer immediately rage quit. What, on Gino? Alright. Alright. It's time to surf.
By the way, big thanks to everybody who, who submitted more sites. Because this series could have been dead without you guys submitting. This series could have been over a while ago. Uh, but, but people actually submitting stuff uh, continuously helped us out. So, What's hacking music? Programming slash coding slash hacking music volume 18. Anonymous headquarters. Here we go. Perfect. This is not going to fit the vibe of this intro part, though. <laughs> this is so stupid. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. I need a better song for this. Oh, perfect. Oh, my God. This is it. This is it. This is it. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah. All right, let's do it. Okay. I love seeing OBS and Coney Shades. Here you go. Wait, there are my lights. Here's the website we're looking at first, and there's OBS. It's me. Okay, here you go. Okay, uh, give me hacker. Give me some hacking. We're starting the video. Hack it, hack it, hack it. Go, go, go. <laughs> Fellas, welcome back to Web Surf Wednesday. It's once again the time to find the hottest websites on the internet submitted by you. And we're going to do something a little different this time. You guys have seen me on my hacker headquarters site where I input all of my... Hacks and programming hacks. Where I access the database in the mainframe. Uh, and other hackerish things. But today, I'm going to let my little AI do the shilling for me. That's right. I programmed a website to say exactly what it needs to say. This website will give me the strongest CTA. And will be sure that you'll subscribe to the channel in the first five minutes. Watch this. Welcome to Web Surf Wednesday. Where? Tell him, bot. Where I take you to a familiar place, but repurpose it a bit. Today's post is a little tour of our living room, looking at things with fresh eyes and making some observations. But first, look at that house. It's got some potential. We, we went off the rails on this. That was a little... Uh, I thought I trained this one better. Let's try it. Let's try this. Hold on. Okay. Hello, and welcome back to another Web Surf Wednesday. The only show where we get to post about something that we did not do this week. This week was a bit of a funny week with me only getting time to play on one of my three games. The only game I managed to complete all seven missions was on Age of Empires 2, The Age of Kings. For though this is getting long. This is getting very long. I didn't do this. I did not play Age of... <laughs> Why is the robot obsessed with Age of Empires? Didn't quite feel like playing Age of Empires and Age of Mythology this week. Maybe next week. Okay. Alright. I don't think this is gonna work. This is a shitty... Shit. Hold on. At least... Hold on. <laughs> okay. You should subscribe to the channel because he puts up a lot of very useful material and he presents it in a way that's highly conversational. Also, he has an amazing knack for selecting footage that really sets the scene. By the way, all the videos below come from his channel and they're totally worth your time. The Hyenas of Regime Change. I think we're plagiarizing a YouTuber. <laughs> Uh, I think this is actually just picking up on... Okay, we jumped on a historical YouTuber here. This is... Okay, this is... This did not work out like I thought. Subscribe to Kony now. Get a free chili dog. More stories on Bellator 194. Check out the latest Bellator 194 event detail. That's the UFC. This is MMA. Why is it posting about the MMA? <laughs> Stipe Miocic versus Francis Naga. What? How did we get here? Guys, you won't get a free chili dog. I don't have that kind of money. Guys, I everything this robot says is not legally binding. Whatever. It's fine. Welcome to WebSurf. Like the video and subscribe. Let's get started. Okay. 
How did that happen? This website said such funny shit when I first did it, and now it's fucking hyenas. <laughs> what a rough site. First up, uh, where'd the site go? Where did my music go? My music cut out. Go back. Thank you. See, this is the best part about being on Twitch. You get to see all the fuck-ups. Excellent. First up, listen, a lot of you guys linked this. Actually, no, I should do this. I should have done this before. <laughs> okay, editor, cut, cut. No, wait, actually, no, no, this is perfect. This is, I meant to do this on purpose. God, why did I, why am I doing it like this? I'm so dumb. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm going back a lot. This is the beauty of YouTube movie magic, is that they can, they can fix all this. They'll fix it out. Okay, editor, uncut. Here we go. Wondering what WebSurf Wednesday is? You're not alone. I have devised a site to get the, only the greatest websites off of the internet. I was about to say google.com, but it's the internet at large. Simply go to websurf.coney.gg and submit your site today, and I may check it out on a future episode. All I need is your Twitch name and the website. We actually got a ton of new websites in that we didn't have before. I thought this series would be over with... Uh, faster than it was but we had a lot of submissions thank you guys so much for doing that also this is kind of sad now this is kind of sad now i realize that he's that's tough email link leaked what the fuck are you guys gonna do huh what are you gonna do with my email don't put this in the youtube video <laughs> there's way less people in here than will be on youtube cut that okay okay so, first off, a lot of you guys submit this, uh, this site. I, honestly, dude, I don't get it. Um, I don't get why it's so fun, but I'll play it, I guess. Uh, this is literal. Um, it's like a word game, I guess. Uh, is it P? No. Uh, T? W F H I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. What are you trying to do? This is what <laughs> I'm trying to find the letter. I've seen this game all over Twitter. I don't I I feel like it should give me more direction. L POV, you subbed to Coney. I'm not gonna click on that. <laughs> Is it? I'm gonna spell my name. None of those. It's in none of these. Uh. Oh, I got it. Sick. Guys, it was D. Sorry to spoil it. Wait, is it one a day? No. Okay, it's just. Dude, I wonder how hard it would be. It would be so hard. Wait, copy to my clipboard. What's on my clipboard, though? Is it like a tweet? Is it a... Oh, you can actually tweet it out. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Perfect. Amazing. Hold on. <laughs> All right, let's do a real... We got to make it look better, though. 16 guesses is kind of embarrassing. We got to do better. You know, I could just keep going for one. Surely it wouldn't take that long, right? Oh god, this is worse. <laughs> 22 guesses. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. This is going to annoy people. This is going to be so annoying. <laughs> you can just edit the tweet. Wait, you're right. I didn't think of that. That's a good point. I could have just lied. Nobody would know. All right, whatever. I got it in 22 guesses. Finally. <laughs> 
Okay. All right. I don't get why this game is so popular, bro. It, it seems kind of stupid to me, but whatever. It's 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 a little it's a little basic. Next up is a is a real game that a lot of people have sent me. Uh, it's actually a history trivia thing. This shit's hard. I played this a little bit, bro. I. It, this is actually a very difficult game. I should separate all of these. This is the wiki history game. So you have to like make a timeline. This is difficult. Kingdom of Italy is obviously older than... What? Italy is younger than 1822? What about Rome? And the Colosseum? And gods and stuff? What are you talking about? That's... Dude, we were made in 1776. We're older than Italy by, like, almost 100 years? What are you talking about? The Murders in Rue Morgue. Novella by Edgar Allan Poe. He's... He's... Edgar Allan Poe is that old? I thought Edgar Allan Poe was like 1890s. All right. Shirley Dara. Dude, this is an old picture. This is a painting. They didn't have cameras. That has to be old. Thank God. Goodyear. Oh, God. <laughs> this is going to be one of those companies that's been around for 150 years. Oh, no. I think it's... Okay, they've been around for like 130 years, but it's still newer than ah, Italy. Okay. Who sent a world history questionnaire to Coney who doesn't even know what the War of 1812 was? Uh, no, I know what it is now, thanks to chat. We beat up Canada, right? They burned down the White House, and we, we said, Okay, you've had your fun. Thanks for stopping by, and then we drove them back. That's it, right? We were like, okay, funny joke, Canada. Now leave or we'll nuke you. And they were like, oh, oh, sorry. There. Oh. oh, big sorry there. Didn't mean to make you mad. <laughs> sorry, buddy. We hate Canadians on this channel. House of Un-American Activities Committee. Oh, dude, this is like, uh, this is the, the McCarthyism, right? Yeah, that's like Red Scare. Seven Sleepers. Story in Christian folklore and the Quran. Dude, that's got. Wait, died? The seven sleepers died? What does that mean? Okay, it's old, right? 387, sure. I definitely thought that said Grandma War. Granada War, uh, it's a painting. So it's. Before picture, it's before cameras, but after this, which is here. Fuck. I forgot about the Renaissance. They made really pretty paintings in the Renaissance. Alright. I beat my best streak, though. Queen Anne's Revenge against the Sanhedrin, the ancient high court and legislature in the land of Israel, is old. Yeah, 425. House of Saxe, Coburg, and Gotha. German dynasty. Between? Bentley is here, for sure. Peace symbols. Are peace symbols from the 60s? No, I. they were used a lot in the 60s and the 70s, but like... They're older, right? No, 60s. Damn, okay. Declaration of Independence. Trumbull. Okay, Declaration of Independence was in between these two. 1890, yeah. Mongkut, the Thai king. Bro, my boy, Mongkut? Bro. Mongkut is my boy. You know Mongkut, the Thai king? 
That's my guy. We go way, but not way back. We go way back. Chateau de Chenonceau. Castle spanning in the River Cher and the Loire Ve How do I know about France? What am I supposed to do with France? I don't fu It's a house. Dude, this game gets hard once you get a book. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Juliette Lewis. I know she's at the end. Perfect. Pune. Made in India a long time ago. Acupuncture. Oh, God. Is this like ancient China? That's gotta be old, right? Put negative 100. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't know if it was that old. I was wondering if this was like, like some new age stuff, you know? Like essential oils and whatnot. Damn. Ferdinand of Spain? Well, he's the sixth one. So that... He's gotta be in the middle. Okay. Alright. Bro, this is a new picture. Alexander Kerensky. It's new, but it's black and white. So it can't be that new. He's not on Snapchat. It's gotta be in the middle here. Dude, I'm off by seven years! Okay. There should be a rule that you can't be off by... Like, if you're off by that much, you only lose half a heart. If he was born... Just seven years later, it would at least be a tie. British Shipping Company. Britain's old. Oh, sick. Okay. Martin of Tours, the Christian saint. Oh, dude. Christian. I didn't know he was that old. How do we remember somebody from that long ago? Royal Enfield. Brand name used by a former British... Dude, I, I'm sick of these European questions. Ask me about my country, please. This is so dumb. Simon Weissenthal, the Nazi hunter. Oh, shit. Dominican Order? A religious order is older. The Cecil Hotel. Wait, is this the one where everybody died? Right? Do you know what I'm talking about? Yes? Okay. Budget hotel. Was that in the 1800s? Okay. 24. Golden Age of Hollywood. Right, 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 right. Russian Orthodox Church. Churches are old. Yeah. Anton Yelchin. Even the celebrities are European. What is this? Alright, he's... Yeah. Dude, 89. He's... He's... He would go in front of me on a timeline. That's humbling. It says American? Oh, it does. <laughs> he is American, isn't he? You know what? I was European posting. Because he had that name. I was like, Anton Yelchin? He's Russian, bro. He's from Russia, along with his Orthodox Church. I learned a valuable lesson today. Hey, I hope this, this helped you too. I hope this taught you something too. If it did, leave a like. It'll help you feel better. Wait, Anton, Anton died? Oh, now I feel double bad. Now I feel extra bad. Agatha Christie's Poirot. A TV series, you say? Hmm, right here. What? This is a new series? Agatha Christie has been dead for years! What did you call him? Poi- 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 Poirot? Pirate. It's the British spelling of pirate, right? Pirate. Archie Comics. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know. I think Archie's like a 50s thing, right? You get a milkshake with your gal, your main squeeze, go necking, and then, get, you know, get pinned. Okay. 40s. Fine. Good. Uh, an Egyptian pharaoh. Oh, he's old as hell. Damn, dude. Ivy League. Athletic Conference of Eight American University. Okay, so it's America. So, is it before or after my boy Georgie Dubs? 1954. 
I didn't... Okay. I hate this fucking site. One more, one more, one more. I'll beat six. United Nations. The principal organ of the United Nations. That's before that. Donald Rumsfeld was born... Oh, he's old as shit. That's like a zero. Ave Maria. Oh, dude, I'm getting lucky here. Emperor of India. Wait, the position was created. Not a particular... Oh, this is perfect. The Emperor... Oh, wait. That's probably colonialism, isn't it? That's imperialism, isn't it? That... Okay. All right. My bad. My bad. My bad. I did, it's more European posting. It's more uh, these goddamn Brits invading my streams. Leyden Jar discovered... Well, I think it was invented. Uh... Oh God. The seagull. <laughs> Play, that looks modern. Here, right? Okay. Hamas. I can't play this game. <laughs> I blame this on the U.S. education system. This is this is a problem with U.S. public schooling. How was I supposed to know any of that? Give me one of those on America, and I would ace it instantly. Speaking of America, welcome to KickAssTrucks.com. That's right, kickasstrucks.com. The only place where you can buy new and used trucks with a wide selection of makes and models, upfront pricing, easy financing, with no bullshit. Check out the kickass inventory. Now, the real reason I wanted to show you this, did you know it's mad cheap to get a truck? Did you know that? Oh my god. You can buy a truck... For 9500 down with only 2000 a month. That's not that expensive. Bro, you get a bed, too. Like, look at all this car you get. Double bunk? Wait, double bunk? Two people sleep? Bro, you could go on an adventure with a lucky guy or gal. All over the country, getting to some hijinks. Someone should be an IRL Twitch streamer in a trunk. That's a career. Dude, genuinely. I've had an idea for, uh, for a, a driving IRL stream forever. I wonder if... So they say no bullshit. I wonder if I can do a little bullshit. <laughs> if I could buy this truck and sell it back to them after a content week. Hmm. Well, well, well. Wonder if I could do that. <laughs> That'd be pretty fun, actually. Imagine the gas price. I mean, it can't be that bad. I'm not hauling anything. Right? The gas comes when you're hauling stuff. If I'm just the cab, it's fine. I'll be fine. Coney, do you know how to drive a rig? How hard could it be? It's a truck. I used to own a pickup truck. This is just that, but bigger. Bro, maybe I'll, I'll splurge for the Kenworth. Oh, look at this. Bro, it comes with speakers. I want to live in a vehicle. What is this surround sound, dude? Is that a TV? That's a TV in the truck. A 10-speed manual. Wait, you can 10-speed on a truck? How fast could it go? <laughs> oh my god. That's a fast truck. Going like 400 miles an hour. Imagine not being able to shower in your own home. That's what the rest stops are for, dummy. And you get to rest stop with other truck folk. That's the life on the road. A 2022 Volvo. Oh, the dream. Someday, bro. Look at this. T I think this is a TV that comes out. Oh, look at all the leg room. Oh, <gasps> a dining area. Incredible. One day, man. One day we'll make it. One day. Most of these trucks are made with those rooms because you're traveling across the country. Yeah, that's the dream. That's what we want. Cruise control, leather wrap, steering wheel, heated seats. 
I love kickasstrucks.com. What's crazy is that that's just a landing page for Lone Mountain Trucks. Do I need a special certification? I probably do, like a license or something, right? Can you just drive a truck on the road without shipping anything? I've never seen it. Will I get pulled over? You can? <laughs> That's quite a flex, dude. This is my midlife crisis. A lot of dudes get like, you know, you'll get a motorcycle or a, a Harley or, you know, something like that. No, I'm buying a big ass truck and not having anything on the back. No trailer. This is my flex. Oh, dude. I love it. Next up, there are a lot of games tonight, actually. And here's a new game. Welcome to Symantris. This is actually cool as hell. Made by Google. Uh, I actually j loved this game when I played it. It's sort of a... Think of it like a, like a search engine t t puzzle game. Hard to explain. But look at this. Type the first thing you think of when you think of museum. Hold on. Can I turn this down? Sure, it's loud. Monkey? <laughs> I don't think monkey is the play. Dude, I wonder if I can find, an, uh, find a way to hook this up to chat. That would be so fun. If I could find a way to have chat do this... Oh, it'd be impossible, though, because of the delay. Museum is art. So you want to get the blue thing into the box. The words most associated with art were just sorted to the bottom. So art has nothing to do with thunder, but has everything to do with museum. I thought it would have more to do with scissors, but... So basically, you just have to move the word below the line. It's basically teaching you to think like a robot. Lemonade, stand. Snow, cold. Uh, cat, meow. And you just want to get all the way to Pytum? Arr. <laughs> I'm doing Google's work for it. Lunch, box. No, uh, meat. Horse meat was number one. That's kind of scary. Dog, cat, teacher, uh, 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 school. Lake, water. Kitten, cat. Planet, uh, Pluto. That's not a planet. Whatever, it's the closest. Marriage, divorce. Kind of scary. Tattoo, uh, regret. <laughs> Laptop, computer. Skeleton, bones. Engine, car. Uh, vegetable, um, carrot. And now you have to think of things with both. Firefighter and recycle. Uh, volunteer. See? Bro! It's tight! Milk calendar, expire. Boom! Poem, honey, uh, sonnet. Okay, I got one. Whatever. Chalkboard, lobster. Those do not go together. Seafood. Uh, chalkboard, chalk? Uh, you can't do that? Can't start with chalk. Uh, potato, vegetable. Spring, season. Rock climbing, rock. I can't do that. That's cheating. Stomach and banjo. Smash! <laughs> Stomach, uh, body. Dairy, milk. Okay. Forest, tree. Uh, time, uh, jogging, run. Harvest, soybeans. Thank God I didn't have to do that one. I might get banned. Asteroid, planet. Captain, planet. Muscle, uh, strong. Award show, dog. Du award show, uh, uh, Emmy. Ice skates, ice. I can't do that. Damn it. Uh, wheat, food. Optics, binocular. Why'd I do that? I could have done glasses. Fear, scared. Cartoon, rocket, Game of Thrones, and rocket, uh, ship. Game of Thrones is also ship. Tywin. Okay. Because <laughs> you ship characters, you know? Oh. Pretty good. I played this before and I did much better. <laughs> I thought I gave my real name. I'm above expert but below pro. Yeah, don't don't leave to do this site, guys. Okay, don't leave. Stick around, but if you want to play yourself, it's called Symantris. I love this game. This is fun as hell, unironically. Uh stay. Hotel stay? Right. Tree wood. 
Umbrella rain? Yeah. Lunch meat. I keep doing that. Boat ship. Table furniture? Rain water. Pasta grain? Yeah, ship, boat. Neighbor. God? Here we go! I love thy neighbor? Whoa, I don't... Coney. Your real name is EXP. It stands for... You killed my game. I couldn't think of a joke. <laughs> What's a name that starts with the EXP? It's impossible. Wood uh, Splinter. <laughs> I couldn't think of one. <laughs> it's impossible. <laughs> Fruit. Watermelon. Sword. Blade. Pond Water. Uh, hammer Tool. Insect, bug, video game, banjo. <laughs> it worked. Uh, singing sunshine, rain. Because you're singing in the rain. It didn't work. That's insane. Uh, singing song. I don't know why that took so long. Song isn't it singing? Singing. Uh, music? Jesus Christ. Uh, furniture, bed, tattoo art. Okay, year? I gotta go crazy. Okay. Spider office bug. Office uh, space. White wine. Drink. Antenna TV. Uh, fossil bone. Jeez, so scary. Rescue. Save. Sculpture art. Again. Mineral. Steel. Instagram shot. I don't know why I said that. I'm not on Instagram. I don't know what I'm talking about. Chocolate! Hot chocolate is chocolate. Oh my god, weight training. Uh, strength. Warm sun. Not warm! Uh, hot! What? Physics. Uh, speed? What? Email technology. Oh my god. Marinate. I... Why was email so low? Email was so low in technology. I guess it is old. Dude, I have to be able to beat 5,000. I have to be able to beat 5,000. It's right there. I got so close. I could have done spam. True. All right. Hold on. I can do this. I'll beat 5K. I'll beat 5K. Okay. Love heart. Halloween. Uh, orange. What? Calendar. Hat. Head. Hamburger meat. It has to be something that only relates to the blue word and nothing else. Flower stem? Football sports. Teachers. Teacher education. Uh, that's dumb. I guess it's close. Paper. Tree? No. <laughs> I don't know why that... Bicycle ride. Ride. If this is scanning me for inputs, I'm doing a terrible job. Neighbor address. Strawberry fruit. Mail. Time. <laughs> Vegetable. Potato. Lion tiger. Star ship. Firefighter. Cop. I'm just doing, like, antonyms, almost. Coffee ghost. Espresso. Ghost. Uh, ghoul. Galaxy planet. Mosquito bug. Circle. Got that, too. Chicken lawnmower. Meat. More grass cooking meat. Stone mineral. Dude, I'm just going back now. I'm just saying what they say. Clothes. Giggle is left. Sailor ship. DNA. Uh, science. That's also gravity. Send it. Hell yeah. Writing. Uh, uh, job? I don't... Okay, whatever. Child school. Wheat grain. That's also milk. Sick. Wheel spin? Radar. Fireworks. Uh, blow up. I don't know. Language. Speak. Lego toy. Lion King. Yes. Cosmetics. Makeup. Wikipedia. Yes! Okay. Okay, wildlife. Uh, animals. Breaking Bad. Badger! I should've said badger! Gambling. Poker. 
Jurassic Park. Go Bloom. Go Bloom. Great Barrier Reef. Australia. Unicycle cartoon. Unicycle ride. Yes! Poetry, art, internet, uh, uh, rainbow, rainbow, colors, Shrek, donkey, journalism, writing, Microsoft Word, outlaw, cowboy. Oh my god, call, phone, Nike, uh, sports, altruism, charity, physics, speed, Pegasus, Visa, yes, lottery, uh, oh my god, Pac Man. Arcade! Uh, Friday. Week! Leslie, nope. What is she from? Parts and Rec! Lottery is... Gambling! <laughs> I got fucking stunlocked by Leslie, nope! I got stunlocked by Rachel Dratch! Wait, no, it's the other one. What's the... It's Ashley... Ash... Rachel Dratch is the... They look the same. Amy Poehler! God damn it! I was so close. Amy Poehler got me. I should have said games. That would have gotten Pac-Man and gambling. Damn it. Okay. All right. This site is so... I can't stop, dude. I'm almost there. Uh, face nose. I can do this. I can do this. Paper tree. I don't know why I do that. I don't know why it's tree. Hotel stay. No, stay. I feel like Google is mining my answers to make its algos better. You know what I mean? Pasta grain. Yes. Bird. Animal? Guitar play. Football game? I'm working for free. Yeah, but it's fun, so it's okay. I'm plugged into the Matrix. Bed sleep. Museum. Boring. What? Cop is boring. Cop, necklace, ship, and shoe are the most boring. <laughs> right, arts, face on beard, onion, veggie. Photography is arts. I just like doing art because it's easy to do. Tax money. Uh, tomato food. Pond water. Book read. Hockey sport. Dairy milk. Dairy queen. Damn. That was could have done both. Vegetable bottle. Food. Bottle's got to be both. Yes. Padlock. Safe. Mountain rock. That's also ice. Sick. Skeleton and sunshine. Darkness for both. <laughs> See? How does my brain work? It's amazing. Ocean. Unicorn. Horse. Observatory. Space. Uh, peace. War? Temperature hot? I don't, I don't know. Could have been Cold War. Oh, that would have done both. Construction office? I don't know why I said that. DNA science? Science is war? Not quite. Fight. That's also cowboy. Uh, jogging run. Volcano is running water. Weed is grain, which is harbor. And jaws. Okay, yeah. Truth lie. Symphony music. That's also compassion. Uh, caring. Politics left. Uh, politics, uh, po uh, Congress, uh, fear, fear is also Congress, okay, water slide, fun, yoga is fun, yoga is good, okay, Samsung, tech, wrestling, pro, wait, why did that go there, pedicure, feet, uh, chainsaw, mythology, gods, confidence, yes, okay, parenting, help, <laughs> no, walking dead, Daryl, Daryl Dixon, okay, parenting, uh, dad, Lottery, gambling, grandfather clock, fire hydrant, water. That's also fishing, gene, science, consciousness, brain. Oh my god, police, cop, pragmatism, uh, electric motor, car, monopoly. Oh my god, it was so close. Toy, toy, coliseum, zoology, animals, shriek, wildlife, animals again. Call, phone, doctor, tunnel, morality, help, <laughs> cell, phone. Morality. Morals. I can't do that. Ethos. I, okay. Whatever. We beat 5K. It's good. <laughs> oh, I'm plugged into the Matrix, bro. I've got the tech brain. I'm in. <laughs> Woo! This game must be miserable if you can't type. This game's got to be miserable if you can't type. See how far you could get with only one word? What's the word? We'll start it here. Engine. Car. 
Car. <laughs> I got to one thing. What would the word be if you only had one? Wait. I bet you could do... Oh, wait, it crashed. Hold on. Whoops. What happened? I f 5 didn't Google crashed. Oh my god, my Chrome crashed. What? Dude, this is bad. I had other sites up. What? My web surf is dead. What? Okay, never mind. I was able to bring it back. Okay. Web surf to death. I killed the site. I beat the whole thing. I wonder if how far you can get by playing one word. Society. Okay, you don't even get the first one. Never mind. They actually have another mode, which is interesting. It's blocks. So instead of, like, a thing, you have to find things that it's related to one of these, and it'll hit everything that's within it. So sports is, like, football. So the AI will see that football is closest related to sports. And it kills all those blocks. Which is neat. It's not quite as cool as the other one. The other one's way better. But it does happen. If you guys want to play this yourself, it's on Symmetris. Just Google search that. This one's more interesting if you want to see how the AI thinks. And I guess the AI is their algorithm, and I'm helping it to think. So, Google, if you're watching this, you're welcome. Give you a little bit of exposure. I like to give, <laughs> like to give the little guys some exposure, you know? I think Google deserves it. They've been working really hard. Next one, uh, I don't know why, but Washington Post made a dumb little mini golf game. It's like a flash game. I thought it'd be fun. Uh, I like little mini golf games, so I thought I'd give it a shot. Just a little mini golf game. It's, a, it's shaped like Wyoming for some reason, so. We're in! Yeah, Wyoming was a, a terrible course. That one was awful. Let's try New Mexico. Alright, go across La Cruces to Albuquerque. Boom. Bro, that's a par 3 I made, I made it into. This is amazing. This is incredible. <laughs> this one might be Twitch exclusive because secretly it's politics. All right, send this one right down Cincinnati. Nope, ended up in Lebanon. Hate it when that happens. All right, we're going right through Cincinnati. There we go. All right, I lost my score here, I think, a little bit. If I could just go a little bit here. Perfect. Beautiful. Texas, that's not Texas. What is this? What? <laughs> that does not look like Texas at all. That looks like an ancient sea creature. All right, go. <laughs> How do I even get in there? You know what? This is easier than I thought. Maybe gerrymandering isn't so bad. Hold on. It looks like a squid. Wait. And it's in. And it's in. There you go. All right. Oh, hey, par of seven on that one. Not bad. What? What is this? <laughs> How am I supposed to do that? What kind of a curve is that? All right, get out of Greensboro. And we're going to Boone. All right, hold on. Just right up the middle. Boom. If I could just get right... Perfect. Bro, par six and I'm at five. I'm under par. Oh, Indiana. <laughs> Indiana's perfect. That's great. Indiana is exactly what I think Indiana looks like. Amazing. Perfect. All right. We'll go right here. Oh, that should have been a hole in one. All right, whatever. Par two. And go. Perfect. Sucked it right up. Next. What? What? Continue. Okay. I don't. Maybe that was an ad in the middle, because I have ad block on. I think that was a... Had to have been an ad. Uh, what is this? Washington? Okay. I gotta go through the lake? Is that a water hazard? 
Will it drop in the ocean? Go. Oh no. I can't, I can't go through the water, right? Yeah. Okay, this is the hardest one yet. Do I bounce off? Oh, you could go through the... Oh, you can't go through the water. <gasps> what? Dude. How? What? This is impossible. Uh, this way? Perfect. Dude, that one was hard. Maybe jam gerrymandering isn't a good idea. What is this? What's going on in Chicago? What the fuck is going on here? Huh? Alright, hold on. Right that way. Bro, dead through Melrose Park. Excellent shot. Right down the center. <laughs> Beautiful. All right, send it right up the side. And then we go this way. And then boom, boom. And uh, no. Gonna bounce it a little bit. Close. I'm gonna bank shot it. Wait, this has a par of 13, so I'm doing pretty good. I don't know. This is still kind of hard, though. Something is certainly rotten in the state of Chicago. Uh, I'm in the lower west side where I hang my hat. Beautiful. Land it right in. Now, this next one is... Oh, it's my state. Oh, my God. I live here. I'm in this district. I'm not kidding. I'm in this district. I'm right here. I'm next to Fort Meade. How did that happen? <laughs> I like this little arrow saying, go this way. <laughs> That's crazy. By the way, Glenn Burney makes an appearance. You remember when I talked about Glenn Burney? On the stream over... There it is. There it is. Everybody knows about Glenn Burney. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, where even is the ball? Where's my... Oh my god, I'm up here? This is gonna take forever. Okay. <laughs> Let's get through my fucked up state. Okay. Alright. Alright. We're gonna go through that. Right down this way. If I could just go a little bit through here. This is so hard. All right. Through Hailthorpe. It's not that bad, actually. It's just a lot of straight shots. It's a lot more intimidating than it looks. I don't know why they included all this over here. Nobody's ever going to go over there, so... It's weird to put that on the golf course, but... I got my prom dress from Glen Burnie. Oh, God. You know what? That's only funny to me. Because I know what prom dresses in Glen Burnie are like. <laughs> dude, Glen Burnie is so fu... I, I wish... Dude, Glen Burnie is such a meme. It's a meme town, truly. What an incredible place. Stop Maryland posting. You're right. I'm sorry. I think every state has their Glen Burnie. You just... You, you, you don't get it unless you've been there. Actually, we talk about Glen Burnie on the podcast soon. I don't know if it was on this latest episode, but... All right, we're going to take a rip through Glen Burnie. Oh, wait. Is that a water hazard? Oh, that's the bay. Oh, that's the Chesapeake. Okay. Through the bridges. Through the bridges. <laughs> oh my god. How do we get through this? Ha Dude. How do I get on this bridge? How do I get on this bridge? Maybe I could overshoot it? I can't get on the bridge. This is insane. Can I enhance? I can't even zoom. Wait, I can zoom. I'm starting to think something might be up with these voting districts. 
Peppo I, Think. I don't know what you're talking about. This is a mini golf game. I found this on FunGames.com slash Congregate. Bro, how do I get on the fucking bridge? <laughs> this is annoying. This is so annoying. I can't. Dude, I'm hitting it with Feather Touch. Okay, there we go. Got it. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. We're good. Move back? Never. I will never stop going in. Now it's a straight shot through Annapolis. Send it. And I'm in. The water. <laughs> and I'm in. And I'm in. Go. <laughs> we did it! And only... what? Oh, what is this? What? What is this? It's a monster. Oh, God. The site says, how about one more? <laughs> how about another hole? All right. All right, I'll go through the... Oh, wait, that's water. Okay. I hate the water holes, dude. All right. Just got to go a little bit past his scales. And we're in. Gorgeous. We got through the Jerry monster. And I was only 31 above par. Reader average is 89. How? How are... That's bullshit. Yeah, Washington Post must have a lot of golf fans. Not even golf, but mini golf. And flash mini golf games. This is stupid. <laughs> this is why I hate politics. Dumbass site. <laughs> so dumb. And uh, for the final site tonight, as a thank you for making it this far. You made it so far into the video and or stream. Guys, welcome to Brant Steel. BrantSteel.net is a site that is host to all kinds of simulators and different games. Survivor, Big Brother, Hunger Games, Dog Eat Dog. You can put whoever you want into these games. In fact, they have so many other Big Brother types. Total Drama Island, I Love Money, RuPaul's Drag Race. Oh, I was going to say Twitter? This is a Twitter simulator, but no. Simple Simulators now includes Danganronpa. Oh, God. Among Us Simulator. Oh, I should have done this. I didn't do this. We'll do this after. <laughs> But as a thank you for making it this far, I've already compiled a game. What? No! No! No, it crashed! No, I had a game ready! Because it crashed on the Symmetra's- No! Wait. Maybe it's still here. No! Hold on. No fucking way. Hello, my name is Fjordsman. I'm hitting control shift T to get all of my sights back to see if it'll come back. <laughs> Hold on. No way. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. It takes so long to build that. It took me legitimately, like... What's up, guys? It's Aaron Nim <laughs> It took me legitimately 45 minutes. Surely you still have the JPEGs. I mean... Wait. Wait. <gasps> Wait. The hardest part are the URLs. So it saves all the ones that I had in there before. I can make this quick. Okay, just give me... Stream intermission. Give me one second. 
Because it's saving all of the inputs. I just had to remember which ones were which. Okay. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Okay. It, it, it'll take me one second. It'll take me one second. Seriously, just... Talk amongst yourselves. What was the third one? Okay. I'll let you know. Dude, this took so long. The fact that I don't have to find the, uh... The images is the real thing here. Okay. Okay. Thank you all for your patience. Okay, okay. <laughs> I can't believe I have to rebuild this. This is so stupid. This is so dumb. It'll be worth it, I promise. Okay. I have to type in every letter because I don't remember who went where. So to get it to auto-populate, I have to put in the first... Oh wait, no, I can just hit down. I'm so stupid. Okay. Barry Bonds deserves Hall of Fame roids or not. Yeah, talk about that. Talk about that, please. Hey, now's a better time than any. You know, we've got a quick break in the stream. If you guys want to check if you've got a Prime, maybe you didn't have a Prime at the beginning of the stream, and now you do, you know. If anybody wants to, you know, if you got a crown next to your name, it's free to sub. It'd be greatly appreciated. You guys should have seen how much I decayed, bro. It's a big climb. Okay. All right. Adding the last few people. Okay. What if I don't have a prime? Oh, it's only five bucks. It's only five dollars. Four ninety nine a month. Steal. Okay. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. I'm just doing images now. Okay. This better be worth it. <laughs> For all this setup? Oh, God. Is this it? Ah, it is. Yes. Okay. Almost done. Almost done. Almost done. I swear. Thank you, Mogu Bear. Are we still ignoring the sad state of Chicago? Yeah, I don't know why how Chicago got that way. What a terrible state. Thank you, King. Okay, I think I've got everybody in. Okay. I hope this works. Okay, I missed one. <laughs> Alright, I, I... Okay. Welcome to the Smash Bros. Hunger Games. Now... You've got all your favorite teams. Your favorite districts together at last. Mario and Luigi. Peach and Daisy. Bowser and Bowser Jr. Mega Man and Pac-Man. King K. Rool and Ridley. Zelda and Sheik. Best friends for life. Morton and Lucas. Fox and Falco. Villager and Isabel. Brawler and Gunner. Simon and Belmont. These two are brothers. Watch out for that. And Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. All of your favorite teams together at last. Now, let me, I part of me wants to fix King K. R I have to fix him for the YouTube video because they're not going to see me fucking it up. <laughs> they're not going to see me screwing it up for ten minutes. Okay. We have to change it. Okay. There he is. Yeah, the, because the images had to be pulled for different places, some of them are a little stretched. Morton is a little squished. All right. District bets, odds are even. You guys want to do a uh, prediction? Little prediction. Which district wins? 
Evens or odds? Oh, I'll do it. You guys love the gambling. All right. All right. Hold on. <laughs> I'm the best. You should have done both Roy's for a team. No, that's dumb. That's not funny. That's stupid. Thank you for five dollars. Uh. Oh wait, prediction. Okay, you already made it. All right. Odds or evens wins. Who do you like? Okay. Good luck, everybody. And may the odds be ever in your favor. Comment below which district you think is going to win. I've got my eye on Morton and Lucas here. These two are inseparable. Friends for life. Why not Ness? Have you ever played Mother 3? Fake fan. Okay. The bloodbath! As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Lucas runs away from the cornucopia. True. I don't know how much this bot knows about the characters, but well done. Fox runs away. Also true. Usually. Likes to be safe. Bowser grabs a backpack, not realizing it's empty. Dumbass. Donkey Kong stabs Pac-Man with a tree branch. Sure. Probably climbed it and broke one down. Falco runs away. Not even in his ship. Can't do that anymore. Daisy takes a handful of throwing knives. I haven't played a game where she does that, but she might be skilled in the art of combat. I get a very, like, ready or not vibe from Daisy. You ever see that movie? Where she's like a trained assassin. She just doesn't have to use it, you know? Morton takes a handful of throwing knives. Ham, I, I think, is a little bit clearer. He's here to kill, right? Morton definitely has killed before. Me Gunner runs away for sure. Me Brawler shoots a poisonous blow dart into Peach's neck, slowly killing her. Okay. So is she dead? Zelda grabs a backpack and retreats. Simon Belmont runs away. Isabel runs away. A lot of zoners. Sheik scares Mega Man away. Diddy Kong gathers as much food as she can. I missed something. You have to specify their gender. Okay. I missed another thing. Whatever. Suspend your disbelief. Okay. For the purposes of this, Diddy Kong is she. Okay. Leave, leave her alone. All right. Diddy Kong has escaped. Bowser Jr. kills Richter with a sickle. Oh my god, like death. Just like the games. Richter's dead. Mario runs away. Ridley gets food. Villager grabs a shield. Luigi runs away, sure. K. Rule runs away. Okay, let's continue on. We only have one guaranteed death, right? Me Gunner discovers a river. Good for her. Daisy receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Items dropping from the sky. Villager tries to sleep through the entire day. Lazy ass. Mega Man over here, Sheik and Luigi talking in the distance. Bowser Jr. kills Simon. Bro, Bowser double killed the Belmonts. Junior killed both Belmonts. Oh my god. With a sickle for both, I bet, too. Ruthless. This kid needs better parenting or something. That's a lot of childhood angst. All right, well, goodbye to both Belmonts. Isabel makes a slingshot. True! Wow! This is accurate. This is an actual lore-based site. This is amazing. Zelda camouflages himself in the bushes. I made so many mistakes. I forgot. Oh, God, this is a bloodbath. I don't know what happens here. This is a lot of characters. No! Oh, no. What is K. Rool pointing at? His victor. <laughs> His victims. <laughs> oh, God. K. Rool sets an explosive, killing off Fox, Mario, Lucas, and Falco. Oh, my God. Dear God, it's a bloodbath. 
K. Rule has killed everyone in sight. Quadra kill. Jesus Christ. That's awful. All right, well, Fox and Falco are dead. Morton is still alive for Lucas, and Luigi is somewhere. K. Rule is the protagonist? I don't think so. I think he's the antagonist, bro. He just killed four people. That's usually not the sign of a good character in the movie. You're not supposed to root for that. Let's go! He's winning! <laughs> oh, God. Oh, dear. All right, well, those, those guys are dead. Morton travels the higher ground. With his teammate dead, he has to escape. Bowser fishes. Good for him. Hope he catches something. Good luck. <laughs> All right. Doesn't seem like he's taking things very seriously, but... Luigi is somewhere. <laughs> As true words have never been spoken. Luigi's up to something, I'm sure. Luigi's up to something. All right, Bowser definitely taking a debt. You know what? Bowser is just relaxing while his kid kills everybody. Junior is doing all the hard work. That's fine. Brawler picks flowers. Did he unknowingly eats toxic berries? Oh, you think he'd be smarter than that? He lives in the forest. Uh-oh. Ridley and Donkey Kong work together for the day. What a team up. Superpowers activate. Oh my god. What a team, dude. They're even posing the same. They're unstoppable together. And thank God Donkey Kong found a new friend. Because I think he's about to lose one. Oh, no. That's sad. Proceed. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Pac-Man. Peach. Richter. Simon. Wait, how did Pac-Man die? I remember Peach got stabbed. What happened to Pac-Man? Oh, he was the tree branch. What happened to Day? Oh, she got hit by the poison dart. That's what it was. Peach was poisoned. Fox, Mario, Lucas, and Falco died in the blast. Diddy ate a berry. Yep. All right, let's continue on. We'll check everybody's status after two days. Wow. 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 How did we get this? This site knows, dude. There's no way it's canonically just picking... People must have run this exact simulation so many times. This is so cute. Adorable. Good for Luigi, bro. Good for him. And Daisy even made the move. It wasn't even Luigi. Convincing. This is so canon it hurts. Oh, God, what's happening down here? Me, Gunner, what did you do? Young lady, what did you do? Bro, there are so many people here. Remember, she did pick throwing knives. Oh, they're together. Me, Gunner, Bowser Jr., Ridley, Donkey Kong, and Mega Man sleep at shifts. Oh, my God, it's a team! It's a team up! Oh, dude, this is the ultimate alliance. Mega Man realized Pac-Man was dead, and he's like, I need a teammate. Diddy's dead, so D Donkey Kong has a teammate. Oh, man, Bowser's just fishing. So Junior doesn't have a, a, a male role model. Junior's dad is just dicking around. And where's me, Brawler? <laughs> where's me, Brawler, in all this? DK was the one to kill Pac-Man. That'll come up later as a plot point. Mega Man will realize, how could you? She was beautiful. Pac-Man. All right. Oh, no. <laughs> there's a lot of friendship happening here. Bro, there's a lot of cooperation here. I don't think anybody wants to fight. That's very sweet of him. Bowser just wants to fish, for God's sake. That's beautiful. Morton, Koopa, and Isabel. Oh, that's so cute. In the clown car? They're together snuggling? Oh, my God. This is adorable. 
Oh, dude, nobody's gonna fight. This is gonna be like the end of the first Hunger Games, but everybody decides that everybody wins. For the first time in Hunger Games history, we have a 15-way split. <laughs> Aww. That's sad. You bitch! What a bitch! Girl boss. Me brawler, <laughs> remember, me brawler's supplies are flowers. She destroyed all of his flowers. And for what? For what, Zelda? Like, Zelda is trolling. She could use some company, and Zelda's out here destroying flowers. That's so sad. <laughs> I got this one wrong the other way. Okay, well, good luck, villager. People on YouTube are going to be confused. What's happening here? <laughs> I It's because when you put them in, the genders are automatically male-female. Male-female. And you have to adjust them, and I did it when I first did it, but I didn't do it now. Oh, no. K. Rule sprains his ankle while running away from Donkey Kong. Oh, no, they're fighting now. Oh, now they're fighting. Oh, no. Wait, that's cannon! Another cannon! This can't be an accident, dude. This is insane. We're getting an a This is subspace. I've stumbled upon the new subspace emissary. Amazing. Wow. The sponsors are pissed because nobody's fighting. That's true. There's no combat going on here. DK tries to run away, tries to catch K rule. Mega Man hunts for other tributes. Oh, he's trying to power up. Dude. He's actually trying to chase people down, get their powers. The group broke up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she actually gaslit him. She gaslit him. That's actually Gaslight Girl Boss. Oh my god. She destroyed all of his flowers and said, Me brawler, where did your flowers go? What happened? Are you sure you picked flowers? Who destroyed your stuff? Zelda is fucked up. <laughs> what a monster. Oh, that one's cute. I love this pairing. Okay. <laughs> Don't show him to Zelda. Okay, Villager was after me Gunner, but me Gunner escapes. Oh my god! Luigi! You monster! That's a child! Where did he even get it? I guess he used his firepower. He has that. It would be so easy to set Morton on fire, too, with a Molotov. You just have to land it in the bucket. You don't have to, like... Because, like, a human being is kind of thin. You just have to, like, play ring toss, you know? It's like a carnival game. Oh, poor Morton. That's sad. Good job, Luigi, though. Good shot. Bowser searches for firewood. Ridley receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. That's sweet. Okay. One cannon shot. Morton. <laughs> Only Morton died. Very peaceful game so far. Honestly. <laughs> After killing those two Belmonts, I'm tired, bro. I gotta go to bed. I'm sleepy. We'll do a status check after. Okay, so these two are together. Weird. How did these two meet? That's strange. What do they have in common? It's like the Doom Guy stuff. Whoops. It's hard because this site is so wide. <laughs> That's so sad. Oh my god, this is so sad. This is so sad. She sang herself to sleep literally yesterday. And now she's crying herself to sleep. The problem is that she has Zelda as a teammate. And she's from Zelda's district. So... Shit's been fucked up for a while. These two do not get along. That's so sad. 
Zelda has given her trauma. Villager Mega Man and Luigi discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Oh, God. <laughs> Luigi was like, yeah, I set a kid on fire last night. <laughs> oh, my God. These two things with each other. Sheet cries herself to sleep. Zelda stays... Zelda is... Is... Homelander. In this universe. She is a twisted psychopath. She is my pick to win. Zelda has a non-functioning human brain. Something is wrong with her chemicals. She's actually a sociopath. Something is wrong here. She does not feel human emotion. I think Zelda's winning. It's gonna be... It can't be Zelda Sheik at the end, because they're together, but... Oh, no. Uh-oh. Me Gunner forces King K. Rool to kill Donkey Kong or Me Brawler. He decides to kill Donkey Kong. Me Gunner? Why would you turn on your district, mate? Why would you do that to Me Brawler? I mean, of course K. Rool would pick that. Remember, he sprained his ankle running away before. <laughs> K. Rool's like, I pick him. <laughs> what a pose. DK tried to look strong there at the end, but it did not work. So sad. How did me gun- I guess she held him at gunpoint, you know? That's so sad. Bowser tries to treat his infection. When did he get infected? Oh, no. Aww. Daisy! She was snuggling with Luigi for warmth. Oh, no. That's so sad. <laughs> A lot of sprained ankles here. Me Gunner is the mastermind. Uh-oh. She said no more tears. No more crying. <laughs> now I take matters into my own hands. Ridley and K. Rool split up to search for resources. Wait, these two are together, right? They are, yeah. Okay, so finally, we actually have a real team. Uh, that's weird. Oh, remember, he's on the hunt, so found his target. Firewood for Brawler, sure. <laughs> oh, no. Luigi, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> she has magic powers. Why is she doing that? Why does she need to do that? A tr where did she get a trident? Her teammate is making wooden spears. Why did she get a trident? Zelda Sheik have a bad relationship, dude. Bowser Jr. practice. <laughs> I think Jr. realizes how, uh, how fucked up this is now. He realizes he's got to start really pulling his weight. Jr.'s starting to go crazy. Okay. Yeah. Zelda is chic? You think so? You think there's a split personality thing going on? You think that's what's happening? Donkey Kong and Daisy are gone. All right, let's check out everybody's status. All right, let's check out the, uh, check out the predictions. So, if you voted odds, I think you're in a good spot. Evens have one, two... Two and a half. Oh, no. You guys only have two and a half more districts. Odds have one... Or one and a half... Two... Three... Three. So it's two and a half to three. But District 6 has Zelda. <laughs> so... I, I think, uh... I don't know, bro. Three and a half? Okay, whatever. <laughs> you get it. I don't know. My pick is, is evens to win. Zelda is the favorite, for sure. Sheik, Ridley, and Zelda discuss the games and what might happen. Oh, Sheik and Zelda on good terms. Good. Luigi, Me Brawler, and Isabel cheerfully sing songs together. Oh, they would. That's so cute. Luigi trying to get his mind off the child he burned to death. 
Me, Gunner, King K. Roll, Villager, Sh Oh, oh, we're splitting into teams now. Oh, wait. Villager and Isabel were on the same team, and now they're on different squads. That's weird. Wait, me, Gunner, and me, bro. What's happening here? Where's the unity? <laughs> Junior sees a fire. <laughs> Adorable. Very cute. That is precious. Truly precious on that. Even robots need company. Proceed. Okay. Uh-oh. Don't go in there, Isabel. Don't do it. Luigi attacks Mega Man, but manages to escape. Bowser Jr. discovers a river. Didn't he do that last time? I thought he found a river last time. Me Gunner sees smoke rising in the distance, but does not investigate. Oh, God, dude. This fire is going to be a problem soon. Ridley poisons Sheik's drink, but mistakes it for her own and dies. Ridley is so stupid. Ridley is so dumb. Ridley is so fucking dumb. Oh, my God. All right, well, Ridley's dead. Ridley's gone. Goodbye, Ridley. The cunning god of death, my ass. <laughs> Just like a woman. Just like a woman to do that. Trying to kill by poison. By the way, I forgot. One of the bits that I did initially was I had Sheik marked as a he and everybody else was a she. And I was like, oh, he's a guy. Uh, unfortunately, that bit is now lost to time. Because all the genders are fucked up. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Bowser, King K. Roll, Me Brawl, and Vigilant Raid Zelda's camp while she is hunting. Oh, shit. We gotta get Zelda out of here. Everybody says we had enough of Zelda. Located the threat. Get rid of Zelda, bro. Get her out of here. Poor Ridley, bro. His fault, though. Just like, like a radiator, like your computer. Not musically, he's just. <laughs> I bet he does. He would. Oh, she's so tired. Sleepy baby. King K. Rule looks up at the night sky. How wistful. Oh, even he longs for more. Sure. Oh, they're trying to humanize her. She thinks about her great land of Hyrule and how hard it is to be a ruler. They're trying to make her sympathetic. Redemption arc? No, she's going to twist at the end. She's going to turn. Oh, my God. All right, well, Bowser's down. The whole squad running up on him. So Bowser and Ridley are both dead. And me Gunner cries herself to sleep. Why does it have to be this way? Why must it be like this? Aw. Cute. <laughs> Junior is actually playing Minecraft. Like a typical child. He saw, like, a cave and a river and is making a house. <laughs> Junior is actually working. Uh-oh. Not by choice. Zelda was like, come here, now! I have a rash. Fix it. Okay. Uh-oh. Hope that doesn't come back to bite her. Oh, my God! Dude! K. Rule has... Is, is actually a monster. K. Rule has the highest body count of all. I think he's killed six people now? With a mace? It's probably a scepter. Boom! Dear Lord, K. Rule. Oh my god. Alright, well, Bowser and Me Brawler are gone. Luigi stays awake all night. He's very scared. Gunner <laughs> forces King K. Rule to kill Vel Zelda or Villager. He chooses Villager. Good idea. Good idea. If you kill Zelda, she'll come back so mad. Killing Zelda would only make her angry. I can't believe Gunner put K. Rule up to this again. 
What happened? Why is K. Rule so deferential to Gunner? Why does he... Yes, my liege. He's the king. Why is he doing this? For what? <laughs> that poor girl. Oh. That's so sad. That's so sad. Awoken by nightmares. Junior cooks his food before putting his fire out. How responsible. Good for him, honestly. I'm very proud of him. He's doing everything right. Oh, no. <laughs> Got rope power. Who'd he get that from? Dude, this is brutal. With a rope? I wonder how Zelda will feel. Wonder if she's gonna avenge Sheik. Let's we'll see. Okay, the cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memoirs. Oh god. Isabel catches King K. Rule off guard and kills him. Oh! She said, Someone's gotta stop him. I gotta do what I gotta do. Thank god someone did it. Man. K. Rule's reign of terror went on for far too long. 7 1 KD. Of, of Isabel, of all the people to do it, he, oh god, insane, Isabel finally putting an end to his reign, phew, Megunner decides not to go to the feast, good idea, she's gonna be mad that her favorite pet was downed though, now she can't tell anybody to kill, Mega Man decides not to go to the feast, Zelda decides not to go, Bowser decides not to go, Luigi can, Oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> For fuck's sake. This is so fucked up. Jesus Christ. Luigi, um... Got taken out of the game because he, uh, he had found a good sponsor. I don't think that could go on YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, Luigi, um, floated away. He floated away in a cloud of smoke and he was never seen again. He got out. Luigi floated into heaven. He went home. Luigi found a way out of the dome and he's safe now. Uh, with Mario. I'm the best. Oh god. It will never be the year of the L again. Oh god. That's so sad. Isabel stalks me, Gunner. Okay. Okay, wait. Didn't Mega Man kill Sheik? No. Who killed Sheik? It was Mega Man with the rope! Oh, she doesn't know. Oh. <gasps> Sure. He's crafting, bro. He is mine. Crafting. We're getting light on entrance now. A lot of people died. Villager, Sheik, K. Rule, and Luigi. Alright, let's check back in on the districts. Alright. So if you're betting... How many people are left? For evens? One, two, three, three. And for odds, one... Two, two versus three now. Evens are looking good. Evens up by one. Even does have Zelda though. Even has Zelda, who's the X Factor. Although now what after what Isabel did, Isabel has two kills. KK rules seven. K All right, is he? He definitely has the most kills. Junior has two. Brawler has two. DK had one. Zelda has killed no one, but has girl bossed herself into a dub. Man. This feels like its own video. I feel like this isn't even web surf anymore. Do you guys remember that this was web surf? We were web surfing. <laughs> and now look. Oh, dude. I thought this would be faster. 
I think this might be its own content series. I kind of want to do this. Like, Smash is out of content anyway because the game's over. I'm just going to make storylines for Smash. We'll do this Sunday. We'll do an Among Us Smash game. <laughs> this is a new salty bet. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. This will be a short thing in Web Surf at the end. We'll, we'll cut this down to the funniest bits. And uh, we'll make this a thing on Sunday. Unfortunately, I, wa I did have more plans tonight, but it is getting late. This went very long, but good uh, good night. Oh, we'll do. I think I'll watch one more movie tonight. I was going to do one more thing, but I'll do it Sunday. But Oh, that's cute. Again, Mega Man's just cuddling with everybody. Migona tries to treat her infection. Dude, everybody's getting sick. <gasps> Isabel did it! Isabel killed Zelda! Isabel might win. Isabel's now my pick to win. She killed with the trident. Dude, that's insane. Isabel killed K. Rule, who was the biggest monster in the game, and Zelda, who was the, the largest psychopath. Zelda was just. Oh my god. Zelda tried to kill everybody, like, politically, right? Socially. K. Rule would do it physically, and Isabel dropped them both. That's unreal. Dude. Aw. I think Gunner's played an honest game. Oh, wait, no. She forced K. Rule to kill two people. Never mind. Gunner is pulling the strings? I think she only had a s had stroke over K. Rule, but... <laughs> Don't try to humanize. Well, I no, it's not even humanize. I think Isabel is the protagonist. Isabel is the protagonist. She's the good guy here. She didn't do anything wrong, right? She only killed the two monsters. Isabel hasn't done anything bad. She only kills bad people. Junior is the protagonist? Oh, you're right. Yeah. No, I think that Isabel is Katniss and Junior is like Peter. You know what I mean? He's trying to find his way, but he's just trying to like, he, he's trying to do his own thing and survive. Isabel will kill when needed. I think Junior, yeah, Junior killed Peach at the start and I think he still regrets it. Junior was ready for the fight. He was all raring to go. He was excited and then he killed Peach and he realized the realities of taking a human life. He watched the light in Peach's eyes die, and he never wanted to do that again. And then he started fishing. Oh, Junior killed the Belmonts. Never mind. <laughs> Take all that out. I forgot. He killed two people. I thought he was the one that killed uh, they, er, Peach with the dart. I liked my story better, but you're right. That's facts. <gasps> oh, no. How bad? Mega Man. What did he do? He was trying to do work on himself. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Junior is absolutely the protagonist now. Junior is the protagonist now. Okay, Junior, Gunner passes out, Isabel passes out. They're so tired, dude. They're getting to the end. This is exhausting. I love these little bits. Discovers a cave. Doesn't do anything. Doesn't mean anything, but... Isabel steals from Mega Man while he isn't looking. <laughs> Very sneaky. Very sneaky. She. I bet she had to. She had to, I'm sure. She's not bad. Pocket! <laughs> Took his metal blade. <laughs> this will give me a lot of bells when I win. Oh, God, Junior. I hope he's okay. Oh. No! Junior just wants his airship. No, Junior! No! Junior's gone! Oh, he's the fake protagonist. You think he's the final guy, but he's not. He's not the hero. Is there only two left? I forgot about Gunner. Mega Man, Isabelle, and me, Gunner. 
This is the worst friendly setup you could ever play on. He's going to the big airship in the sky. All right. Even's got two. Odd's got one. Isabelle's gonna win, dude. Gunner has killed nobody. I don't know if she get, she has it in her, bro. Oh, man. All right. Let's take a look. Okay. Mega Man's hidden. He's chilling. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Peaceful. Peaceful. Isabel would never kill anybody that doesn't deserve it. Remember, Gunner hasn't killed anybody yet. Gunner has been pacifist run this whole time. What the fuck? Dude. They just talked. They thought they were really connecting. Isabel let her guard down for one second. Isabel let her guard down for one moment. Why would me Gunner use a sword? That's the other guy's thing. Why not a gun? Oh, dude. This is the actual twist. Turns out that me Gunner was just playing the game the whole time. The whole time she was just lying in wait. We're now down to our final two. Mega Man, don't do anything drastic. Stay alive. <gasps> he didn't have any electricity! He ran out of electricity! No! That's so sad! It's over! The winner's me, Gunner, from District 10! At the end, Mega Man just ran out of power! Me, Gunner, is your ultimate champion! Dude, she struck what she needed to, though. I got. Girl boss! Actual girl boss! She did what she had to do. It broke her heart there at the end, but she had to kill Isabel. She knew there was no way out. Oh, my God. Oh, no. That's so sad. She had to manipulate Isabel. The world is a cruel and fucked up place. That's so sad. Oh. That's so sad. Eyes of a monster. Yeah, something changed in her. Something is very different. We need this to be new salty bets. 2150 subs? I'll do an Among Us right now. 2150 subs? I'll run an Among Us with Smash right As now. As it turns out, we were playing Squid Game all along. <laughs> Squid Games! 2150? I'll run it right now. If you got a Prime, send it, please. Thank you, Jesh Peep. Thank you. What happened to Isabel Squid Games? Thank you, Foggy Days. Thank you, Celsa C. Thank you, Yoshi McCloud. I'll pop an Among Us right now. Thank you, Milky Kong. Uh, do I? It says in just imposter. Can I? Do I have to say who the imposters are? Adjust size. Wait, can I not do this? Ten players. Oh, I can't. I can't set who they are. Oh, that sucks. Can't change the cast. All right. We could Danganronpa. <laughs> Thank you, Godoyf. Oh, man. Thank you, Hello Derp. Thank you, SD Tempo. Edit cast at top? Oh, did it say edit cast? Wait. Oh, there we go. Thank you. I pr Thank you. I'm sorry I missed that. I thought it was for something else. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for the subs. 2165. All right, let's go. Let's go. Thank you guys very much for the subs. Let's get it going. Smash Bros. Among Us. 
All right. Uh, who do we put in this? We need new characters. Grab the top 10. What, like Mario, DK? No, we need... Definitely need Meta Knight. Okay. Kevin Nash. I don't think he's in Smash. Sonic. True, Sonic. Wait, we could just go by colors. Uh, green is... Who's a green character? Steve. Oh, I don't want to do Steve. That's boring. Yoshi! Yeah, perfect! Yoshi! Lime. Oh, wait, that's Yoshi. <laughs> Plant? No. Link. Yeah, you need Link in there. Link wasn't in the last one. Olimar. No. Kirby. I'll put Kirby. This is just the original 12. Um. Terry! <laughs> I need, yeah, I need some humans in there, for sure. Good call. Dr. Mario is very funny. Yeah. K. Rule, we already did him. Sephiroth? That's good, that's good. I'll do Banjo, why not? Only Banjo, though. Ganon. Ganon is the last one. Wait. Mm. Mm. Next sub, I'll swap out anyone you want. Just prime and tell me what you want. Drop a prime or a sub and I'll do anything you want for anything. Only one. Only do doable for one. <laughs> Only works once. Happy Challenge Days. What do you want? <laughs> Who do you want? Who do you want to swap? Yoshi for Ganon. You got it, brother. <laughs> oh, Dr. DP's. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's tough, but thank you for the resub. <laughs> thank you, Dragon. That's tough. That's tough. So close. All right. We're good. Did I have all the names lined up? Okay, this is the worst part. I hate this part. This part sucks. You have to literally... Hold on. The way I had to do this... Where is it? I had to go to this, this, and get every render this way. It sucks. Nobody knows how to pronounce it. Is it Chala? Chala days, like holiday, right? Is that it? All right, hold on. So what do you need? Uh, Meta Knight. Oh, God, I don't even... Oh, my God. This sucks. This is why I didn't want to have to redo everything, dude. This is annoying. Okay, Ganondorf. Uh, okay. Meta Knight. Damn it. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna do it this way. If I make it smaller, it's better. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is better. Dude, I have to do this by hand constantly. This sucks. Did you skip Link? I was just doing it as they come up, but... Uh, Sonic... Banjo. Oh my god, Banjo's at the bottom. Kony has never talked to a Jew confirmed. N not many, actually. Not that I've never talked to them, but I don't know how to pronounce... Forgive me. Wait, oh, there's no Banjo. Hold on. Banjo Smash Ultimate Render? Oh, 
Here we go. I'll do this. Uh, Link. Thank you, 16-bit Yoshi. See, this is why I gotta prep these beforehand. I think if I do this as a stream segment in the future, I'm gonna have, like, three of these prepped. I want a Squid Game so bad. I want to say Squid Games <laughs> for Smash. All right, Terry. Okay. Terry Smash Render. I can't believe he hasn't made a Squid Games. Do do do. Butter butter butter. Where is We Fit Trainer? Okay. I think we're good. Make nicknames the same as names, and we'll do this. Because I don't want it to be like. Well, no, if you do non-binary, it probably just says there. We'll just leave it there, because it'll just say there. Uh, non-1 and 7 contains invalid characters. What? 1 is just an imager link, like all the other ones. See, this is what I'm talking about, bro. The non-imager links won't work. Well, this isn't... This is imager, and it's still not working. Let me try Smash Wiki. Is there a space at the end? No. Still says 1 and 7. What do you want from me? Not member 1? Member 7. Yeah, but it says... It says... Oh, team 1, member 7. Oh. Oh. My bad. Ha uh, ha, ha ha! All right. Uh, not a great picture. Why is this render I got on Business Insider? Why is Terry there? Still can't use it. Fuck. How about this? Good. Okay. Terry. Terry looks a little weird, but that's that's just Terry. That's Terry. Okay. All right. Here we go. Do I not know who the imposters are? How many is it? Two. Okay. All right. There is now an imposter among us. Hold on. Got to get into uh Got to get into the mood. <laughs> okay. This is so stupid. There are currently two imposters alive. A body is found. It's Sonic! No! Sonic's down! An investigation begins to discover clues. Following the investigation, the survivors vote for who they suspect is the imposter. Whether innocent or guilty, whoever has the most votes will be ejected. Okay. Banjo votes for Sephira. Oh, it, it, okay. Did they say how the body was killed? Because Sephiroth has a weapon, dude. It's right there. Ganondorf votes for Kirby. Kirby votes for Ganondorf. They hate each other. Thank you, Dwayne. These guys hate each other. Not friends. Link votes for Meta Knight. Meta Knight votes for Kirby. Sephiroth votes for Meta Knight. Oh, dude, Meta Knight's out. Wait, it might be Kirby. Tie for most votes. Event of a tie, no one is ejected. Oh, man. Okay. Chapter 2. Kirby's dead. Wh oh, is this just... It's just votes. There's nothing... <laughs> I thought there'd be more stuff like the Hunger Games. Okay. Well, now we can make guesses. So, Meta Knight died. Remember, Ganon and Meta Knight... I don't think we're on good terms. Banjo votes for Trainer. Mario votes for Trainer. Why do they think Trainer... Ganondorf votes for Mario Link. Tra oh, trainer's gone. Oh my god. Oh, trainer's gone. 
Goodbye. But she was not an imposter. <gasps> oh, no. What will they do now? Starting to dwindle down. Banjo's dead. No. Bro, if it's Dr. Mario, I'm going to die. He's thinking, bro. He's like, Dr. Mario's hatching up a scheme. Dr. Mario votes for Meta Knight. Ganondorf votes for Meta Knight. Oh, dude. Ganon Meta Knight's gone. Meta Knight is sus on Ganon, though. Meta Knight has something out for Ganon. For sure. But unfortunately, he cannot defeat... Oh, Terry. Okay, Terry's the other one. Ter it's Meta Knight and Terry. It's Meta Knight and Terry. Oh, dude, it's Meta Knight... Oh, wait. Hold on. Okay, so it's not... It's Ganon. It's Ganon. Ganon's turn... It's Ganon and Doc. It's Ganon and Doc. I got tricked. Wait, is that game... To her left. <gasps> okay. All right, you know what? This one kind of sucks. <laughs> I don't know how much I like this one. Well, that was fun. Yeah, that was All right, maybe this one needs a little bit more work. We'll do one more. We'll do one more. Because you guys subbed for it. We'll do something fun. I don't think it's as big as a, as a Hunger Games, but... What's the Danganronpa? Oh, God. Oh, I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. What the fuck? Oh, my God. What's the easiest what, paint drying? Okay. <laughs> What's the shortest one? Total drama? <laughs> what is this? No. Too much. Too much. <laughs> Come on. Circle simulator. Circle? What? What? Game of Thrones? What is circle? Okay, they're all just voting. Oh my god! Thank you, E. Compton! 30 bucks?! Bro, it's 48 characters! I'll do Danganronpa with 10. I'll give you 10. Okay? Do 12? I'll do 12. Test it first? Yeah, let me see what this looks like. A body is found. It's this. Oh, it's just Among Us. Bro, it's Among Us. It's just Among Us. It's... It's Among Us. I can't. The play... The play here... Is just Hunger Games. What's Big Brother? <laughs> what does this look like? Change relationships and vote? <laughs> Alright, uh, Big Brother might be it. Hold on. Face banishment, safe, safe, safe. House events. Eddie jumps to the pool to rescue Chiquita the pug who has fallen in. I don't know. I can't even tell what these get. Yeah, these these aren't even games, bro. I think Hunger Games is the is the answer. Hunger Games has plot. Survivor might work. Oh my god, why are there so many? They're going to Cambodia. <laughs> Cambodia. Pivot? E Compton, you donated thirty dollars. I'm trying to make sure you get your money's worth. No alliances. This wins. Makes a lamp. I think it's just Hunger Games. Yeah, Hunger Games is the only one. I was wrong. We have to Hunger Games it. Hunger Games is the only good option, I think. Maybe Total, Total Drama Island, though. We'll do that on Sunday. But not now. It's 1140. I gotta go to bed.
We'll Hunger Games next time. We'll do a bunch. I think this is a new thing that we'll do. It's pretty fun. Hunger Games is, is very fun. It's great. It's excellent. All right. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Oh, wait. I got to do the... Oh, God. I didn't do the web surf outro. Shit. Hold on. I forgot about that. Let's do that quick. Okay. Right, right, right. We got to do the web surf. I forgot we were doing web surf. Okay, let's do this quick. Let's do this quick. Season 10 and 15 of Big Brother stars the greatest Big Brother player of all time and fellow streamer Dan Geesley. Well, I, I don't think he's in this, though, right? I think I have seen him stream, though. Come to think of it. I think I've seen him. Okay. All right, let's do this quick. Thank you for joining... I was about to put on the glasses. Thank you for joining me on this exploration... Thank you for joining me on this exploration of the internet. I hope you had a good time. And if you did, go ahead and like the video. Hey, it, it'll help out the video, and it'll help you feel better. Subscribe if you like, I guess. I feel like I don't subscribe to anybody anymore because it always just shows up in the top. But if you do subscribe, maybe you'll see the rest of my videos. Whatever. Say bye, chat. We'll see you next time, YouTube. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, wait. I'm still listening to Among Us music. Whatever. That won't make it in the video. Goodbye. <laughs> bye. Okay. Dude, I can't believe they're getting rid of Chance. How are we going to do this in the future? You guys are going to have to actually participate. They're dropping Chance. That's so lame. Ugh. Okay. That one was all over the place. Good luck to the editor who has to compile all this bullshit. Man. That's tough. Okay. Chance almost got me fired. <laughs> Dude, 2169. Thank you guys so much for the for the subs tonight. I do appreciate it. What is Chance? Uh, we just did it. It's something on Twitch when you... Uh, it makes everybody in the chat click a button and type something. Okay. Good night. I wanted to do uh, Mojo posting. But, uh, no time. No time. We'll do Mojo on Sunday. Uh, probably another one of these Hunger Games things. These are fun. Tonight was long, dude. Both of my things went way too long. Um. Tomorrow? Oh, yeah, tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is a sponsored stream. Tomorrow is a HelloFresh stream. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Food Hunger Games? Well, it has to be brand safe. So I have to be nice. Uh, I'm thinking about getting Tropical Freeze. Because I wanted to play that anyway. But we'll see. You're still missing a Cuphead achievement. Shut the fuck up! I am not. Do Fortnite. They added pizza. Pizza? Like a pizza pie? Wait, there's a game on Steam that's, that lets you uh, cook with chat. It's called like Chef Squad. That might be fun. I don't know. Cooking Mama feels too easy. All right. We'll think of something. It's fine. Uh, we're going to raid Hungrybox because he's doing a big Smash tournament and it's not over. Go watch Hungrybox. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hello, fresh stream. Like I said, I have no idea what the plan is, but I'll figure something out. Sunday is uh, a little bit of content, and then I really want to play Def Jam, bro. Try to play some Def Jam fight for New York. Uh, not tomorrow because it is not brand safe, but we'll see. All right. Go say hi to HBox. I'll see you soon. Among Us, play me out. How I love this pretty bed. Now I'll rest my weary head. Ooh. Good night. Ooh. People get to more events, start their brands, start saving up, and get actual money into Smash tournaments. When one company does not actually... Cody, thank you very, very much. When one large company isn't going to step it up, well, they may have a little bit. Then we'll get we'll find someone who does. So two thousand dollars a week for these weeklies. 
This is the coin box. I'm retweeting it right now. Every single Wednesday, every single Wednesday, you will have these massive prize pots directly given so